March 10th, and welcome to Mailbag Friday. Got a few things off to the side, and as well as in the bag. So how's everyone doing? Well, I can't find out what they're going to say. Hi, Perry, you know. Um, we've got some uh, announcements to make. Some great news is going on. Uh, I'm going to be coming back east to uh, Pottstown, PA, to do a show called Uncle Rico Live on May 13th, a Saturday. Uh, it'll be a real big show, and I hope to see everyone there. So, Tom? Yeah, sorry, Perry, I was sorry, uh, Perry. trying to fix the sound issues. Uh, okay. There was no sound for the intro. Sorry, sorry about that. The, uh, the thing kicked on, but there's sound now. So, uh, yes, Perry... Uh, in you could not have been more energetic in that opening uh, for this big news. Wow! I'm coming back east. I'm going to a place called the uh, uh, the pot. I don't know where we're doing this. Wow, you really pre- you're really prepared today. Oh God! Why don't we try it what? again? Hey, hey, why don't, hey, you know what, Perry? Here, let's let's try it again. Let's try it again. You know what? Since the sound wasn't on, I'm gonna go right to the intro, and then we're gonna come back out, and you're gonna be good morning, everybody, high energy, and you're gonna say, "I got big news," and let's try this again. Okay? We'll be right back. It's never gonna be this again. All right, you know what? Perry, let's have a conversation like adults. Good morning and welcome to another Mailbag Friday. All right, I've got some humongous news coming up. I will be flying back east to, uh, I believe it's Pittsburgh, PA. No, Pottstown, PA. Let's try this again. Should I run the intro again? Let's try this again. No, shut up! Shut the fuck up! I'll leave you! I will fucking leave you! I'll leave my fucking house! I'll get the fuck out of here! You mu- Control yourself, Perry. Should we start again, or can you do this? If you start that stream again, I will fucking leave the house. Uh, watch your language, Mr. Potty Mouth. And number two, uh, I just want... You said that you had some big news uh, to open the show with, and I just don't think you had the proper energy the first time. Second time, you messed it up. Now you just said Pittsburgh. We're not going anywhere near Pittsburgh. So... Uh, Let's do it again. No, we're not doing it again. Well, you know what? I actually, I I actually played, I actually played the wrong intro. So let's just do it one more time. I actually played Monday's intro. No, sit down, Perry. What do we talk about? You darting away? No, come back. Sit down. No, come back, Perry. Perry. I didn't get up. Perry, turn your chair around. Then you're not going to the show, and you're not going to get paid. So stop being a baby. Okay, we're going to do this right this time. And you need to come out and you're going to be super energetic. You're going to give the right information so I don't have to do this again. Okay, here well, we go. Well, 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 all right, well, I don't Nothing have to right. coming out. Keep calm. We'll talk over this. Ow! 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 Perry Caramello Live! How dare you! All right. Now, let's redo this. Okay? No, 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 no. no. You, this is, you're coming in hot. You're coming in cold here. This is, start the whole thing over. Welcome. Welcome to another Mailbag Friday. <clears throat> it's March <clears throat> 10th this morning. So I will be coming back east to pit to uh, Pottstown, PA, to do a Uncle Rico live stream. Wait, can I interrupt you? Why are you saying back east? You've never been east. I've been to Chicago. 
So that's back east from That's me. not east. That's the Midwest. That's not east at all. That's nowhere near the That's east. back east from California, knucklehead. No, no, it's, it's east on the compass, but it is not considered the east. So you've never been east. So I've don't never say, been on the east coast. No. All right. Let's, no. Just, let's just start okay, again. I've never let's been start, on the let, east. Perry, let me just run the intro again. If you start again, I am shutting the computer off and you can kiss my ass. Well, you keep messing it Got up. Got it? Get your hands off my mouse, first of all. You're not Tough gonna... shit. No, 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 no. No, it's going to be tough S for you when you don't get paid for anything, okay? So don't say, first of all, you could say Pittsburgh. That's not true. I think people are confused now. Back east, you've never been east. You've never been to the east coast. So let's go. If you don't get it right this time, I am starting it over. So let's go. Well, because I don't have any news on this fucking matter. You know the date and, and you know I the... And I just said the F word again. So stop doing this to me. You don't. You know the date, and you know the town. You wrote it down, and you know who's going to be there. So why don't you try it again? Date, May thirteenth. It's a Saturday. Pottstown, PA, is is uh, the Uncle Rico live stream that we're going to be doing. I don't know the name of the facility. I don't know where we're going to be performing, but I will be there. Got it, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. All right, that's the worst ever. You know what? Of course it's the worst ever because I wasn't prepared! I know, you never prepare. And I gave you all the information, not only yesterday, but today, before the stream. To yourself, you gave me all the information. You can mutter under your breath all you want, but I did. I gave you all the information. <laughs> God, are you disgusting. Okay, uh, why don't we just try it one more time, coming out from the intro, and you can actually, no. without no. cursing, without no. yelling, without doing anything no. like that, okay? One more time. No! Nothing is coming out! Keep trying. to another Mailbag Friday. This is Perry Caravella Live, and I got fantastic news to my ladies and gentlemen out there on PCL Live. Whew. On May 13th, Perry Caravella Live will be also joining Uncle Rico at the Uncle Rico Live stream in Pottstown, PA. Got it? I don't know the location. I don't know the name of the facility. I just know the city, and I know Uncle Rico Live. And I'll be there with Bob Levy and the other characters and the other characters on Uncle Rico. Shuli, Bob Levy, yes, yes. Bob Levy, it's Shuli, it's um, Martlin, um, and I think one or two other people. Hopefully to seeing Scarlet or Gina or, or the, the uh, She-Hulk or whoever shows up. But everybody's out to just make me look like a freaking idiot. Thanks. Is that, re is that really what you're getting from all this? Yeah, when I'm, when I'm hardly uh, informed of things, yeah. Hardly informed. I talked to you consistently yesterday about this. I called you, like, okay, so just if... For people who don't know what Perry's talking about, because he's doing a horrible what you job. Called me about is we we called you called me to tell me that we're scheduling something in back east, and I was debating. Back, on stop wanted... saying back east. You've never been back east, so stop saying back east. I'm saying back east. I don't give a rat's ass if I've been back east or not. Right, That's you, back east. Right, but usually when somebody says I'm going back east, means they've been there before. <laughs> Or are you just saying back east, like, oh, that's the back, and that, you know, that's where it is. I'm just asking. Back east, whether it's Chicago or it's farther east of Chicago, PA, of course, is the east coast. Yes. Damn you. Okay. Uh, first of all, 
I first, I'm not even the first person who mentioned this to you. Uh, Bob Levy was. Uh, I then mentioned it to you last week. We talked about it even on Monday's stream. I said that this offer was out there and we would uh, look into the possibility of doing it, okay? And then between Monday and today, I had conversations with uh, Bob about, uh, hold on a second, this isn't going through. Uh, about conversations about Bob, uh, with Bob, about you doing this show. We worked uh, a lot of things out and there's still some things to work out, but uh, we, we're safe to say that you are now on the bill, which you are. And I talked to you I yesterday it. extensively. I talked to you even before the stream. Bob and I were on the phone with you talking about it. Okay, so please don't act like you were not informed. It's not that I was not informed. It's the way I'm informed and the way you want me to explain where we're going to be, which I have no clue. You just said Pottstown, oh. PA, so that you do have a clue. That's the city. That doesn't mean the name of the club or the name okay, of the facility. Okay, but that's minutiae. We, we'll get the name of the club. Oh God! I right. have the name of the club. I have the. De I have. I mean, the I mean, details. normally people normally like when I do a rock concert. When I did rock concerts and booked bands, I would announce which club we're at, like at the Ventura Theater. And, in and the what city would you do, Perry? Would you, read, would you read from like a paper? Like, like how would you announce that? Like, would you memorize it? Like, how, tell me, please, how you do that. And I know you weren't broadcasting back then, so please tell me how you would do that. Sometimes I would read from a paper. Right. Okay. Or, so, so that would be terrible for this stream. Okay. That would be terrible. You know. I and said like, sometimes. I didn't say all the time. Oh, but I'm not going to look at the paper and read from the paper as I'm. As I'm on on live on on this, no. Okay, so listen, Perry. I don't want to have to like lead you through this, okay? Like where I have to like literally like like marionette you to get this uh, information out. I really want you to do this on your own, but you couldn't. So uh, I'll help you out, okay? Uh, so you want to give all the information that you know about it right now? I just did. I just did. May 13th, Pottstown, PA, Uncle Rico, Uncle Rico Live. Uncle Rico I'll be there. Live, right. Do you know who else is going to be there? Bob Levy, of course, and yes. uh, hopefully Scarlett. <laughs> hopefully. Okay. Who else? Who, who's, like, actually on the bill? I, I You didn't tell. I, you just you said it. You just me, said it earlier. Know. Okay. You know what? People get mad at me sometimes where I, like, direct you a little too much. And this is why, because you just can't get anything out. But okay, I will tell you now. It is uh, the Uncle Rico show live with stand-up comedy featuring Bob Levy, Shuli, and Mike Morse of the Uncle Rico show. And there's going to be very special guests, okay? Anthony Cumia, Casey Armstrong, of formerly of the Howard Stern Show, Mike Buschetti, Vince the Attorney, Cardiff Electric, and... Featuring a big, uh, your, your name's very big on the flyer, uh, Perry Caravello. In what is your first, not only your first live performance in over three years, but your first performance ever uh, on the East Coast. A, on the East Coast. Really yes. anywhere outside of California. You've never performed anywhere outside of California. Am I wrong about that? Have you ever performed as Perry Caravello? I, I'm not as Perry Curve alive, but I have performed in Texas when I was in Texas once. Okay, okay. So when was that? In the 80s? No. When was that? I wasn't even a comedian in the 80s. Okay, so, when was, so, so I'm asking you a question. Jeez. When is it? When, is when, it? Did, when did I... Uh, I went to see my daughter in 96, and I went back to see my father in, in uh, 2000. Let's see, I went to see... Christina in 96. All right, we're getting caught, in, we're getting caught in the weeds here. We're getting weeds, 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 2008. weeds. Weeds. It was in 96. Thank you. Pause. Weeds. Uh, listen, we got a lot to talk about today, but uh, I want to get this out right now. This is a big deal for Perry to be live somewhere. And I'm telling you, if you're a fan of PCL, you're going to want to make this show. Uh, if you're local to the East Coast, you're going to want to make this show. Uh, now, there was a lot of negotiating here. Garrett's gonna come with you. Garrett will fly with you, okay? Garrett's gonna be there, okay? I'm going to be there. I'm not gonna be performing, but I will be there. Bodyguard, here's my bodyguard, so. Yeah, well, you have plenty, okay? Jim is going to be there, AKA Joey. You're gonna have all of Team PCL there. 
Uh, there's going to be a meet and greet if you get uh, the VIP tickets. And I think everybody uh, out there in PCLN really needs to support the show. Let me get the link up for everybody. Um, okay. Here it is. Uh, you want to go to Soul Joel's. That's the venue. SoulJoel's.com slash shop slash tickets slash Uncle Rico. Now, there's different... Um, brackets of ticket uh i'll just move that over so it's not with the the chat box you can get regular tickets you can get um vip tickets vip tickets come with the meet and greet and vip tickets have a very limited allotment so i've been told uh so if you want to do a meet and greet with perry and everybody else that's going to be there you really want the vip tickets and they're cheap they're not they're not expensive tickets uh they're not they're not doing anybody uh, dirty in fact i'm on the page right now let me just see what all the tiers are. It's Saturday, May 13th at 6 p.m. Doors open at 5. The show starts at 6. General admission is only $25. Then you get preferred preferred seating is the next tier up. Then you get a signed poster with that, including Perry. And Perry gives a beautiful signature. I've always said that to you. You, you do Thank a great, you. great signature. VIP tickets. I've had people call it a John Hancock. So VIP tickets, which to me, something like this should be like close to $100. Guess how much it is? It's only 40 bucks. It's forty bucks for a VIP wow. ticket. That, that's that that is dirt cheap. It's dirt cheap, and you get to meet and greet with everybody, including Perry. Uh, you can take photos and all things like that. You can hang out, and maybe we'll do like a PCL meet and greet uh, somewhere. So I think it's a big deal. It really is. It's a big deal. So you're gonna want to get. And okay. by the way, if PCL people get those tickets today, uh, it'll really show the, the force of nature of PCL. Uh, but again, the VIP tickets are limited. So I'll tell you what. You can't uh, describe this, so why don't we call somebody who can? Why don't you call up Bob right now, and he'll come on, and he will uh, tell us exactly uh, all the nitty gritty and fill the audience. Hang in. on, let me go get the uh, the box. Wow, you really were prepared today, weren't you? Whoops. Okay. Just had to plug it in. I did. That's fine. I'm on and ready to go. All right, call him on the All right. Phone. Okay. Okay. So Perry's going to get Bob Levy on the line. He's going to tell all you guys about the show. Everybody's very excited that you're going to be a part of it, Perry, and I'm sure the PCL audience will want to turn out in force. Okay. So... Actually, actually, back up, back up, back up, back up. Mm -hmm. Hello? Is this Mr. Bob Levy? Yes, who's uh, calling? Who is this? This is your uh, f new friend and fan, Perry Caravello. It doesn't sound like you. Well, at least I'm talking with a real voice. <clears throat> or, um, come on. Is this a prank? Yes, yes, it is me. This is a prank? It's not a prank. How would it be a prank? Of course, it's me. Who, who's this? It's Perry Caravello. Oh, oh, Perry. How you doing, buddy? Well, how just waking up a little while ago here. I'm kind of still, yeah. uh, still, uh, you know, getting woken up and stuff, but I'm doing okay. Oh, good. You, you excited about going to Pittsburgh, I heard? I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be fun. I've never been back to the East Coast before. Okay. Yeah, no, I, I love You've Pittsburgh. never been there at uh, all. Stop saying back. You've never yeah, been. We're gonna, uh, we're gonna, we're gonna be in Pottstown together. Okay, it's gonna be Pottstown, not okay. Pittsburgh. I just looked at the sheet, and it's gonna be at Soul Joe's at Ballroom on May thirteenth. It's gonna be huge. You get to meet Kumia. You, you get, you know what I mean. We'll get you on that show. It's gonna okay. be huge for you. This is gonna be big. Your first time out in that stuff. Are you, are you excited? Mm. To fly? I'm very excited. Oh man, this is gonna be good because my Kinda pool nervous. will be ready by then. So we can go swimming in my pool. Um, that's a maybe. 
Yeah, and I got a jacuzzi too. If you want to do that okay. too, we can. Me and you can probably fit in it. Uh, it'll be good. So we'll have fun. If Scarlett or Gina or the She Hulk's with us as well. Well, yeah, they're supposed to be coming. We'll see if they're coming in that. Uh, there's supposed to be a lot of there's be a lot of surprise guests coming. Are you all right? You choking or something? What are you doing? No, I, I got some freaking phlegm. I have to deal with all the time. It sucks. Yeah, no, you, there's probably a lot of girls going to be there. They're going to want a piece of, of Perry. So That's what I, I don't want. Even... I want my girls. All right, you want to go to a strip club too? Maybe. No, no need. Got there's enough of them one. over here. Got enough of no, them over a, here. There's a good, there's a good one called Men Men Only, and uh, yeah. we're gonna go to that. So it's all you know what I mean. It's about it's a lot of college guys that'll be there. So they're Not very interested. good dancers too. Not interested. No, oh, okay, come on, Perry. But I'm it's interested be in fun. my girls. Okay, my girls. Okay, if your girls come, your girls come. If not, there's a lot, we got a lot of guys coming. It's going to be great. We're going to have a lot of fun. And uh, we're going to barbecue in my backyard. I got steaks coming for that thing. We're going to do the your Perry show live, uh, PCL live on the Friday. We're going to have your Thursday here. We're going to have fun. It's going to be uh, a great time. You're going to love the jacuzzi because uh, we can both find, probably fit in it. It's just big enough for the both of us. So nobody else can come in when we go in a jacuzzi, okay? Uh, I've never been in a jacuzzi that's so small for only two people. Well, it's in the house, that's why. It's like, it's in it's in, it's in in the bathroom, so we can only do two at a time, so. That's a bathtub, go, that's a bathtub, what? that's not a jacuzzi. Well, whatever you want to call it, <clears throat> look, it, it, it blows bubbles and that stuff, it, 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 we can probably fit both of us in there, it'll be tight, but you know what I mean? We'll make room, we can get it in there. And uh, you don't drink, do you? you not alcohol, drink? no. Okay, not, not, you got to let me know what you want. So I have it here, and then I'll have the hotel stocked with whatever you want. And that, and you haven't been eating fast food, right? I'm trying to stay away from fast food. It's just too much peop- Too many people like to bring me that, that crappy, you know what, fast food. And I don't want to even say the name of the, fa- the place because it just drives me nuts to even think about who it is. Okay. Well, I stopped smoking. Remember, we made a deal. Oh, you did. Yeah, How long are you going to say it. stopped? Well, if, if you stop, if I stop smoking, you're supposed to stop eating fast food, and you're kind of eat, eat, eating it. So, what does that mean? I'm not eating fast food. Somebody okay, just threw just something said, at my door. Don't worry about it, Perry. There's some at your door, but you can't eat it. Just put it in the refrigerator until I start smoking again. Then you can have. No, it you're not going to smoke. You're not allowed to smoke again. Okay, all right. You're not allowed to smoke again. I want you to stop smoking for yourself, for your health, and for your family, your wife, your kids, if you have kids. Yeah, I have kids. What are you kidding? I'm dumping all the time. I've been dumping in women. What are you kidding? (laughs) How many kids do you have? No, this will be good. I mean, truthfully, we go to the strip club. We're going to go to the the, the jacuzzi. It's really good. If you want to have a cigar in the the jacuzzi. I know smoking. I don't no no tobacco in my body, no al- no alcohol in my body. All right, if you want to have a fish fillet in the jacuzzi, that's fine too. I don't really care because I everything- can't stand fish fillets to tell you the God's honest truth. I never liked them when they first came up. Well, when my mom used to always eat them, um, I was always the quarter pounder guy. A quarter, quarter pounder, pounder well. with cheese and nothing else on it. When I was a little oh, yeah, kid, what- all the way up till uh, just recently, I'm now putting lettuce, tomato, and onion on it. Okay, that's good. To hear. That's that's healthy. It sounds really healthy. Yeah. Uh, what about uh, okay? So you don't. You, what kind of weed do you like? I got I got edibles. I got uh, I got the liquid. I have the the no stuff marijuana in my life ever again. I've been clean and sober since the year two thousand. I don't want to go down that road ever again. Okay, we want to go to the gym here. I got a gym by. Nearby, I heard you go. All to right. Go to if you like, if you have a fitness club nearby, let's do that. Yeah, fitness club. Yeah, there's, there's one there, but it's going to be good. Like we're going to spend too much time in the jacuzzi. I think that's what's going to happen. Okay. But it's going to be fun. Okay. Yeah. Hey, be nice. Uh, I, everybody's talking about this. Can I? Can I see? Uh, I need you to show me something. The what? tiger picture. Can you get it for me? Because I, I never really seen it close. Because I work at night, and then when I catch the show, 
kind of rerun so it's not live. I don't uh, I don't like taking pictures off my wall, but this is Please. the last time I'm going to take this picture down. Uh, and I'm going to put it back immediately, too. Oh, you don't have to put it back, but I mean, no, let, Perry, let, leave let, it let, out. Let leave it out. Please, th because th th I, I, I never seen it up close. I know you do it for the Soviet okay? goat. You did it for the Soviet goat, right? And he's your friend. Okay. Bitch. You called me a bitch? What happened? I told your friend. I just want to see the tiger picture. That's it. You, uh, you got two tiger pictures. Show, bring them both. I want to see both You're of them. I want no to see. Fuck. Just two of them. This is it. And what about that statue of the guy in the back? That looks not, pretty cool. There's no way I can hang it up. There's no the whole fucking. No, Perry, bring it over here. That he, he can't. No, no, I don't want it sitting there, Perry. Can you bring it over? He doesn't want it to sit right there. Just put it on the chair. He hasn't seen it. Well, let me see. Get that, get that statue, too. Grab that statue on the way. No, no, bring it here. I didn't see it. I got to see it. I can't see it. It looks like a cat from here. It's too far back. It's right in front of you. I, I can't see it. It looks like a cat. It's very small. Where is it? What is it? There's no, there's no closer to get that painting. All right, bring it, put it, sit down and put it on your lap so I can see it. Let's talk, Whitey. We got it. I like to see it. That's a beautiful picture. Thank sit down you. with it. Sit, sit down with it. Sit down with it. Okay, sit down. Why does it have testicles between its eyes? That's what? weird. It, it looks like it has a pair of testicles between its eyes. That's weird. No, it doesn't show testicles. Between its eyes, it looks like two, a uh, ball sack right there. Look, if you see it, look at the ball sack right there. Let me see the kitten. That's the chest, you knucklehead. What? I can't God see it. God almighty. So well, what? You mean right in this area? Yeah, right on the right on the forehead. There's testicles on it. That's kind of weird that somebody would uh, give you a great painting like that oh, with Jesus testicles on it. Christ, you're a fucking nut. No, no. The, you have two nuts on there. I'm a nut, but just two nuts on. Between his eyes. You see the two testicles hanging? They're very, very tender. His eyes. No, that's not nice. Look at between you the eyes. This? You got a ball bag. Up there, up higher. That's a vagina there. This? Up there, if you look between the eyes, there's two testicles hanging between its eyes. Look, it's, it's balls. They're, they don't look like my balls would be a lot lower. They probably that's... cover the nose. But look. Whatever. Look at it. You, well, whatever goes through your sick, perverted mind is disgusting, okay? Good. That's it. Those are the testicles where you're pointing right there. Look at that. Yeah, rub them, rub them. Ah, oh, that sounds good. Oh, oh, God. Rub them. Yeah, let me see that. Now, how old is that uh, cat? How old is that? How old is this picture? Yeah, the cat. It was back to when I was a little kid. My God. Uh, oh, I, I don't know, when I was maybe uh, 12 or 13? Maybe. Oh, wow. So, were the testicles always on his eyes, or are these new? Somebody this put those is on. the picture, okay? Now, are you bringing the picture with you? Hell to, no! Uh, bring it to Pittsburgh. Hell no! I love that picture. It's not coming it's up, and not coming off the wall, and leaving my house. How about I'll buy it? I'll buy that You're picture. You're not buying the picture. It's not for sale. For $500, I'll take that, and you can keep the testicles. I'll take it. You're going to buy this picture off of me for 500 bucks. Yeah, I'll buy it for Who's at the door right now. Perry, I'm sorry to interrupt. Uh, get your door. And I got to correct uh, the both of you, uh, Bob and Perry. It is not Pittsburgh. It is Pottstown, PA. It's in Pottstown. Okay. Perry, so it's do Pottstown. me a favor. Yeah. Don't answer the door yet because I got to get the camera up. Hold on. Do me a favor. Just don't answer it yet. I want to get the camera. I want to get the camera up. Where's what? the testicle tiger? Put the testicle tiger back up. Well, let me see the testicle tiger. Where You're is it? You're not gonna see it again. I just wanted to see the testicle tiger. I mean, you don't have to yell at me. Son of a fuck! And these goddamn motherfucking bouncers! I'm gonna fucking throw it all away. I'm tired of this shit. Wait. Testicle tiger. What happened? 
I'm coming back. Shut the fuck okay. up. What? Oh, my God. He's mad at me now. Don't be mad at me. I'm your friend. Don't listen to other people that say you. I'm not your friend. They're, don't listen to them. They're trying to be bad people. Look, I know uh, you're my friend, okay? This is not for sale. Got hey, it? Perry, right. Hey, Perry, get your door, right? What's taking so long? Uh, you're, you're... <clears throat> Let me see it. Oh, there it is. Oh, look at it. Shut, move your arm. I can't see the testicles. Shut up! Yeah, there, there's the testicles. Bring it closer. Turn it to the right. Okay, there. Look at that. Is that a is that a uh, African bald tiger? Is that is that an African bald tiger? Hey, man. Be careful. You got? Yeah. No, that's not coming in. That's not coming in. No, 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 oh, is that is that a delivery? Bring that, bring that in place. Bring that in place. It's warm in here. Oh no! It's a little cold out there. All right. Why the fuck am I getting stupid shit like this? Come over here. All right. What did you get there? Wow. Is that dog food? What do you guys show it? Fucking, fucking dog food. For what? what I am dog? not going to have an animal ever. I will never have an animal ever. My home doesn't have animals. Hey, God Perry. Fucking damn it. This is, you have a guest now. It's, you have two guests, actually. Hey. How you doing, Tom? I'm doing good. How are you, Tony? Hey, Tony, say hello to Bob Levy. He's on the phone. Yeah. Hey. Hey, Bob. What's up, buddy? Hey, can you get Perry to feed the testicle tiger some of the dog food? Uh, no, no, no leave, leave the tiger. No, Perry, no, Perry. No Perry, fucking way! That picture goes back on the wall! Shut the fuck up! No, Perry, bring it here. Can, can I just uh, just put it back? Get the fuck out of here and I'm not breaking the goddamn thing! Shut up! Shut up! Shut the motherfucker! up! Perry, is, is this... Where's he going with the test? Tony, Tony, I, I, do me a favor. Yeah. Keep an eye on where he's putting that. Do you yeah, see where I he's putting it? it? I, I see. He's going right back here. Okay, if you cool. fucking touch that fucking I'm not. Picture, I'll fucking kill you. Hey, Perry. I'm gonna fucking kill you. Perry, what did we talk about? What did we talk about you threatening to uh, murder people on the stream? And you're doing it already. I'm sorry, Bob, is this a good sell of the live show? Or is this not working? Because I, I thought he'd oh, no, be this, happy. This is working. This is working. I, I thought and he'd be happy. Oh, by the way. The uh, tiger uh, picture, Perry will sign it at the show. All <laughs> testicle tiger pictures will be signed by Perry. That's right. And, and, and by the way, uh, when uh, when Perry comes back from his defiant P, Bob, can you mention that the, the, the newest guest that's been added to the lineup? I'm sure Perry would be very happy to hear that. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, that should go well too. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I will do it. But if you have a testicle tiger or a ball tiger that has testicles, bring it to the event, and it will be signed by Perry. The fucking picture is not leaving my home. Perry, can you please sit down and stop acting like an animal? Uh, Why does Perry have picture of naked people in his room as statues? This is true. What? I told him to get rid of that years ago. I mean, I don't know why he still has you it. You can't have that kind of stuff up when you're doing a show. This stupid thing Grand behind me. One. We can bring, or it can be brought, right? What are you talking about? The, the thing. <laughs> hey, hey Perry, gonna... I need your undivided hey. attention now. Bob has a very special yeah. announcement. Now, we've mentioned everybody as of right now has been mentioned who's going to be at this show. Don't just go over it again. <laughs> Obviously, everybody from the Uncle Rico show... Bob, Shuli, and Mike Morse, okay? We're also going to have the great Anthony Cumia. Casey Armstrong is going to be there, right? Okay. You know, right. Are you excited about those people yeah. so far? I, I don't know these people personally, but yeah. Well, you're be going nice. to know them personally. That's how it'll you be meet, nice. That's it'll how be you, nice. uh, it'll be nice to meet, meet them face personally, face. right? Uh, you it'll also nice have uh, Vince the Attorney, Cardiff Electric, and uh, the latest uh, entry, Bob, why don't you take it away? I'm sure Perry would be very happy to hear this. Okay, the next guy that is going to be put on the show, you're going to love it. If you look next to you right now, Tony Hawk is coming. Well, good for you. Yeah, we'll be flying out together, bud. I mean... I don't want to be in the same, you know, show with you. Yeah, no, we're in the same show. Same show, same seat. You're not in the same show yes. with me. He just said I am. 
He's he's with you. He's going to come with you. He's going to be. Bob, I want the real Tony Hawk, not this guy. I. This is. That's not the real one. That's the real one. I hired him. Yes. Uh. Yeah. Nothing more said. No, it'll be good, I, Perry. Like, I'm the real. Tony I'm not Hawk. going then. Then I'm not going. What? Why? You got to go. Take me off the bill. Take well, me off the bill. No. Because I'm going. Yeah. What? You're a punk. What? You treat me like shit. You you, you open stupid stuff when I told you not to. Well, for, you, you made a mess in my home. It took fucking hours upon hours to clean. Well, first and this of, and this house has got so much garbage in it. I'm gonna uh, uh, within a week or two. I'm gonna start throwing stuff in the trash. I'm that fed up. Well, let's just start first of all, Perry. I was told to come over because you were gonna apologize to me. Oh, I, that's right. I, I'm sorry. Okay. Yeah, okay. Just apologize and get it over, and everybody's happy. Okay, we're all happy, so we're made up. We're going on the show mm, together. No. It's going to be fun. No. We'll be on the same flight. I mean, I'll be in first class, but... You know, I got maybe bigger I can... news. Bigger news. Here it is. You guys are sharing a room. We gonna we got two beds, but we're going to push them together. Are you fucking crazy? We're going to push the beds together. No yeah. fucking way. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. No. I'm out. I'm not no. going. I'm not going. No. I'm not going. If if I got to share a room with this guy, I'm not going. No, you got to only share a bed with him. The room is different. And, and no. Perry, can I interrupt? What? May I? May I interrupt for a second, Perry? I just I don't know if you know the business like I do, like Tony does, like Bob does. But once you've made the commitment to actually be on a poster or a flyer for a show, there's really no contractual way you can back out. And actually, here's the poster. Uh, well, that's not the poster. Uh, here is the poster with Mr. Hawk on it. Uh, it's, it's right there. You can see it on the screen. Uh, there you, there's uh, Mr. Hawk, and there you I are. I am in the back. The guy to my left here looks like Vladimir Putin. And then the guy to his left looks like Andy Dick with oh. glasses on. You know, I did I leave my glasses here? The guy in front of me to my right with those glasses. That's Jackie Martling. God, yeah. Looks like he lost a lot of weight. He did. He got AIDS. What? Uh, what? He's got AIDS he, now? No, hearing AIDS. He can't hear good. Oh, yeah. oh. no, you have AIDS. Not like That's you. why you're not coming. No, Perry, you have are, are a spokesperson for people that have HIV, AIDS. I don't have HIV. I don't have AIDS. Stay the fuck away from me. All right. You don't want Bob, it. Bob, kick him off the show or I'm not coming. I can't. I Look, look, I already ordered the one bed. I can't. I can't cancel the room. With, it's got the it's one got fucking beds. bed. I prefer a floor, so fuck the bed. We can flip a coin. There's no coin flipping. You sleep on the mattress. I don't like mattresses. I like my mattress, and that's about it. Well, we'll We're bring it with us. We'll br You're not yeah, fucking touching you. my mattress. Get it. Pick don't it up do now. Do. Wrap it. Start wrapping it. We're going to bring it. Bob, this guy's a fucking troublemaker. All he wants to do is start shit with me to be funny, which is not funny to my eye. Pisses me off, and I'm sick and tired of getting angry about, about things. Tired of it. It's it's okay. Look, we look. We already got. You know what I mean. Damn. We already got the two beds pushed together. It'll be. It's good, Perry. We're gonna work through this together. This is the road, baby. I'm not this staying in the same the room. Road. I'm not staying. I am not staying. Look, I'm not staying in the same room with this guy. I'll stay in the same room with Garrett, my bodyguard, rather than this guy. Well, I'm sure. I'm sure uh, Tony Hawk will guard your body that night. I'm not interested. It's Listen, you have to come because it's already set. We got the beds pushed together. Every This is the road. What happens on the road What about Joey, a.k.a. Road. Jim? Stays on I the don't road. Even know, I don't even know Joey as Jim. But, but I'd rather stay with him rather, rather than this guy. I can't push all the beds together. I don't have time to do this. We already had it done last night. <laughs> well, 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 then I'm not going without pushing beds together and doing stupid shit. Perry, you know my wife. I know your wife. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. 
I don't know why she's with you. I mean, I don't know why she's not going. Or better yet, why she's with you. Oh, man. Oh, that hurts, Perry. Oh. That hurts. Oh, I've always God. been good to you. Oh, with that stupid snow bag? Oh, God. I gave him a snowboard, Bob, and offered him lessons. You oh, offered you. Wait, 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 wait. You offered me lessons? Yeah. When? Uh, numerous times here and on Instagram. You offered me lessons. Yes. Well, then let's go. I've told you. We'll go. It's raining this weekend. I'm not, well, this weekend we're going to get stuck, so we're not yeah, going. we're not going this weekend. weekend. But you and I are going. I told you. All right. Then let's then 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 I will be cool with you yeah. about that. And let's do it. Yeah. Okay. Told you. I got the links up there at the mountains. All right. Do you have a truck? Yes. You have a truck. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. See, See, my truck is no more. It sucks. No shenanigans in no, the mountains. No. Please. No. That that that. Now, now I now I respect you. Okay, yeah. right. I'll, I'll respect right. you. Okay. Wait, so are you, are you okay with doing the live show with him now? Yeah, if he's gonna take me snowboarding. Okay, listen, absolutely. let me let me just say this, Perry, and and I want Bob to hear this, and I want Tony to hear this, I want everybody yeah. to hear this. Perry is known for quitting his own things all the time. We're done. We're done. We're done. This is the last. I say you know. that. Okay. Okay. I'm, but listen, this is not something you can pull out of. We made a contractual uh. agreement. You can't just say if you get angry. Uh, I'm not doing the live show anymore. Okay, now people are committed to you. Okay, you got your name on a flyer. People are buying tickets to see you. People are going to be flying to May see you. May 13th, I am in PA. Yeah, I know you're I saying mean, that now. But, but if you get mad between now and May 13th at Bob or Shuli or anybody or anything, you can't I, pull. You can't do the I'm quitting, I'm not going to be there routine. Yes, Perry? I'm, I'm, I'm going timeout without saying timeout because I don't want to get yelled at, One number one. So I'm going, okay, now I'm going to say time out. Um, I have been committed to May 13th East Coast, meaning Pittsburgh, uh, Pottstown, PA. I'm committed to this show. I'm there. All right, unless I am fucking deathly sick and have the flu or whatever. Even then, you could still go. No, I can't. Yeah. If I have COVID, I'm going to be in the hospital. COVID. You're not going to get COVID. It's, it, the room is COVID friendly. Well, right. yeah. All I need to do is kiss Jennifer Aniston. Eh, oh, I'll get COVID. Hey, now. I don't want to do that. I love the girl, but I don't want to do that. I, I want her healthy, and when she's healthy, then I'll kiss her. Hey, can I just mention something? Right, and and if Bob wants to stay on for this. Oh, wait. Wait, say, wait, say again. We're not going to tell him Randy's coming, right? No, I thought that was private. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's going to be – that's that's for the – all right, Bob, you know, that's that's something you and I talked about. Let's not let's not get into that right now. I thought uh, – okay. That was a private conversation. What the fuck? Forget that you heard that, Perry. Yeah, Bob, that I, we were going to bring him out later in the show uh, after – Oh, really? Time. Oh, really? Oh, fucking really? Yeah. So I go to prison in PA rather than in California? For beating the fuck out of the motherfucker? Why would you have to beat anybody and, up? Uh, it's just a lover's fight. That's all that is. I'll tell the cops. Don't worry. You're not going to jail. A spat. Not a fight. Yeah. A spat. Yeah. Perry, there's plenty of time between now and then to work out the little fine details, okay? The, the, the big news is that you're going to be going on the show. And so is Tony Hawk. Okay, you're both on the bill. It's going to be fun. And for fans of PCL... Uh, I'm going to be there. Jim's going to be there. Garrett's going to be there. The whole gang's going to be there. Oh, guys. Way, when's the last time? The, Where's the girls? When's the last time uh, we were when all in the same room together? Guys, you don't need girls, baby. No, Come no, on. no, no, no. I want my women. I need my women or else fucking no way. No Scarlet, no She-Hulk, no Regina, no Courtney, no, no Whitney. They don't live out there. They don't have to live out there. Oh, all right, all right. I'll, I'll see what I can do. We get Whitney on Here. the show. Get Courtney on the show. Okay, listen. Hey, Jennifer on the can show. I, may, may I please interrupt your delusion for a second? I do have an offer I need to get out here because it's it's big money. All right, uh, it's a hundred dollars, and this will be good. You know, good money to save up for the trip. Uh, Wheeler Walker is offering a hundred dollars. He calls you parents, but I'm not going to say that. I'm going to say Perry. One hundred dollars for Perry to cut both sleeves off his sweater. Crop the bottom so his belly shows, 
with a box cutter and wear the sweater for the remainder of the thing set. Fucking mind! Okay, there's nicer ways to say no, Perry. I'll fucking kill you! Oh, Perry, what did I tell you about threatening to kill people? Why are you touching my shit? I thought you were gonna. Cut Why are you? I'm not cutting this. That's what I'm not cutting okay, this. Okay, okay, they said you were. Perry, look. You don't touch anything on okay. my desk again. Right, Perry, is this sweater worth a hundred dollars? It's my. F oh. I've, I've had. <laughs> right, but you can buy a new sweater with a hundred dollars. Oh Jesus! I'm Christ. just saying you got to think logic. I'm, I'm not destroying this. Okay, it's but it, clothes that I've had for some time, and I'm not destroying so it. So it's an old, it's a ratty old I'm sweater. It from my mom's era. It's ratty okay. old. It's Perry. You could buy a brand it's new sweater. To me. It's valuable to me. Okay, so hundred dollars isn't going to cut it. Okay, all no. right. I, okay, all right. It's uh, Perry. The guy just doubled it. It's now up to two hundred dollars. Now that sweater is not worth two hundred. I know that, and you get a brand new sweater for a lot less. You could do that. Bitch. Let's do it. Let's do it. Why the fuck do I have to destroy my fucking life and my goddamn fucking stream, you motherfuckers? Perry, can you stop with the cursing on the morning show, please? Oh, There's no fucking respect. Perry, no fucking respect. Would it help if we got some McDonald's? Get out of here with that shit, oh, Perry. I don't Never my okay, I'm not touching Perry. Never my I no have. violence, Perry. Perry. Listen, Perry, listen. Just sit down for a second. Before we start doing anything, I just want to be clear with you. You don't have to do... Perry, take a deep breath and calm down. I want to talk to you for a second, okay? You're not being forced to do anything. You don't have to do anything you don't want to. But there's a gentleman willing to offer... And by the way, don't do anything until you have the money. But if you accept this, it's $200. That sweater is not worth... Three dollars, honestly. If that would that would be in goodwill oh, for like, go Perry, fuck yourself. I'm telling you the truth, Perry. Okay, I'm just telling you the truth. That sweater isn't worth a lot. It isn't. It's 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 worthless. Somebody's willing to pay you two hundred dollars for that ratty old sweater, and you can go out today. And by the way, all winter clothes now are discounted at every department store because it's the end of the season. So you can get a nice sweater. I will order one online for you that's as close to that as possible. I'm serious. I don't want you to think that you're destroying your stuff, but you are getting paid $200 for it. And I, if it was me, I would do it for 20 bucks, but that's me. Now, do you want to accept the $200? I think you should. I'm not forcing you to do anything. $200, but, but yeah. All right, let's wait to see. Let me get confirmation that it's being sent, okay? So that's an offer accepted. I'm gonna go offer accept tonight. By the way, Bob, are we uh, are we gonna be doing live? Are we gonna be doing live offers at the live show in Pottstown? Absolutely. I mean, it, 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 uh, we're gonna do it in the room with the people there, and yeah, it'll it'll be amazing. And if you can bring that tiger picture there, there is no fucking way. I'm traveling with the goddamn pictures on my wall. No. <laughs> No, right. no, 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 okay. no. I'm not moving mm. pictures out of my house. Mm. From my late okay. mom, no. So that's definitely a no? I said that's a definite no. If you're in California and you want to buy it off me when you're out here, that's one thing. But there okay. is no way I'm moving that fucking picture off my wall and traveling with it. Okay. Okay, when I if I buy if I buy the picture, the testicles come with it, right? I'm just making sure. Oh God! Hey, Jim has a good question. Uh, our producer Jim, formerly known as Joey, he wants to know from Bob: Can the tiger painting have its own plane ticket? That way, it's uh, can sit next to Perry on the plane. I would fly that plane. I would fly the testicle tiger in uh, for stupid sure. Fucking stupid, stupid, stupid remark. And the tiger will have its own room. That's not bad. Yeah. You're, oh, yo, so the so the picture gets its own room, but I can't have my own room. I got to sleep next to this guy. No way. Well, I think. Yeah, exactly. It, it, no, it's a special painting. Yeah. It's on glass. Oh, oh sorry, that, sorry. That picture's got balls, and I like that in a painting. It does not have balls. It's part of the freaking tiger's fur. Go get it. Go get it. Get me the picture again. Let me show you. You're not going to see the picture again. 
Let on, me see the right? picture again, and let me see the balls on it. And you'll see There's no see. balls on a fucking tiger's nose. I seen hair on the balls of the nose of the tiger. There's not balls, damn you, and I'm not bringing the picture over here again. Right, Perry, can I interrupt you for one second? Uh, now what? Can, Perry, can, first of all, take a deep breath. Okay. No. Hey, Perry, we had a long talk. By the way, I, I, just to let everybody know, I didn't even talk to Perry this week until yesterday where we had a long talk about your behavior. Can you just take a deep breath? Okay, you told me you, weren't act, you wouldn't act like this. Okay, so do me a big favor right now. Uh, apparently, you have a, a delivery, a good delivery that you will like from a, a nice female delivery person, but she's outside at the, da- the gate and she's having a hard time getting in. Can you just go out and meet her, please, just real quick? It has to be you. Okay, thank you. And I will run this with, I'll make sure everything's cool in here. All right, hold on a second, Perry, before you go out. Let me just check on something. All right, Perry, before you go out, before you go out, let me just see if she's, uh, hold on a second. What are you doing over there? I got my jacket, bud. Okay. He's not That's doing all. anything, Perry. He's just going to talk to us. I'll, I'll talk to the stream. Go ahead. All right. Go ahead, Perry. Not moving, though. Go ahead, Perry. Yeah. She's actually down the block a little bit. She just walked down the block. If you could just get her. She's really nice. Please. All right, Tony, go for it. Uh, everybody, everybody just be quiet. Uh, we don't have We don't have a lot of time here. Cancel. 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 Raining like a motherfucker, and I'm not walking out there. No. Perry, number one, I don't have the phone with me. Okay, take the phone with you. She's walk. She literally just left the gate. She's. You're gonna want this. This is a big deal. Gate is wide open. Perry, this I'm is leaving a... my glasses here. Well, Perry, the, the longer you talk, I'm the longer you. I'm leaving the hat here. Why are you not running down I'm there? She's almost. To see what you're looking at because it's raining like crazy. Okay, well, just. And I'm not she... up in the rain. Perry, she's out by. She's walking down Reseda Boulevard. Can you please just head out there? All right, Tony, let's go. Let's get this done quick. Get the tiger painting. Bob was asking to see it. No, stop. Don't be violent. He Bob was asking to see it. Put it in the chair. No. No. Gonna fucking make sure you're in the Go hang it, Perry. I'll hang it. The show is over. The fucking show is over. Perry. Bob kept asking me to see it. Yeah, Bob, right? Bob Bob was asking to see it. I just I just wanted to see it, Perry. It's okay. No. No. Get the fuck here do you leave? Perry, come on. We gotta finish the stream. I'm here to help you with the mailbag. Out of my house now! We got some food. Come on, bud. Come on. Come on. That's. Why are you still here? You are to leave my home. Bob said you were gonna. You're going to get a lot of money for that painting. I'm not yeah. selling that painting. For $500. 10 grand. Ten gr- Would you s- 10 grand? In other words, who's offering me 10 grand for that painting? It was not me. <clears throat> no. Anyway, All listen, right. Perry, I guess the woman, I guess the woman left. You don't have to go out anymore. Uh, Tony, thank you. Uh, everybody else watching 
You may or may not see that footage uh, somewhere else, uh, but we'll just we'll move on from that. Uh, thank you, thank you to everybody uh, involved. Now, Perry, if Bob wants to stay on the phone with for this, he can. But uh, I I just while you're worked up in this mode, what you on, please? No, he's going to help you with some mail. Okay. Yeah, mail he's not. He's not. Why is he here to help you with mailbag? He's too much room with mailbag. Because he opens stuff. At, show him how to do a mailbag, please. I'll I'll table my thing for later. T show him how to open oh, mailbag. Oh Christ! See the note? Note on it. Here, I'll read the note. Or you got it? A scare mustard. Here, let me read it. I'll read it just quick. Hey, Scare Mustard. Here at Cat Collation, we are big fans of PCL. Please wear this shirt on your stream to prove you are an alley to cats everywhere. We know you never killed any cats. You only paid a bill. From Thank Phil, you. Phil Collins. The Phil Collins. The Phil Collins. Yes. You know, he likes cats. He's a nice guy. Want me to do it? I'm doing it. I'm your assistant. Bob, it's appreciated to have you on the stream. I'm going to hang up on you now. All right. Listen, I love you, buddy. I uh, love you too, my friend. Oh, Thank by the way, so by the, before before Bob goes, uh, you're going to do his show out of the coffin uh, on Sunday afternoon. This coming yeah. Sunday? Yeah, for an hour. Get your hands I'm away. Not, I'm your assistant. I don't care. You're not my assistant. Hey, Perry, can you not... Can you, not yes. talk, can you not talk over your own plug? You're going on Bob Levy's show on Sunday afternoon. I believe that's going to be, what, 2 o'clock East Coast time, Bob? Yeah, I'm going to start it at 1. Perry's going to come in at 2. And if you can have that testicle tiger with you, that no! would be good. It'll we'll be no! So that'll be 11 a.m. Uh, West Coast time. And Perry... Oh. Me. Later on on Sunday, you're doing the Chrissy Wait, Mar show, so you got a big day on Sunday. Uh, that's going to be at 11 p.m. East, 8 p.m. Pacific. Okay. Yeah. I love you guys. Be good. Well, Barry, thank, you thank you very much, Pittsburgh. Bob. Thank you so so much. Looking love forward you, to the live show. This is cool. Thank you, whoever sent this. This is cool. What is it? Uh, oh, right. cool. Put it on. See you. Later. All right. I'll talk to you later, Bob. Okay, then. Um, I'll hold it. Well, hold on a second, Perry. You're not going to put this on right now. You, 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 we'll, we'll put this on maybe on Monday. You got paid for the sweater deal, so you're going to do the sweater deal. In fact, I'm just confirming that you did. Uh, the guy sent a screenshot thing here. Uh, this is this is. Yeah, I, Perry. This again. is the last time I'm destroying my clothes. Okay, okay, so Perry, if somebody offers you a lot of money, then you want to turn that down. That's fine. Okay, but you got paid two hundred dollars for this. I confirm. Hold on. Wait. Wait. Let me just tell you what you need to do. Okay. Stop acting like everything is so I gotta torture. I got to take my shirt off first. Well, hold on a second. I think I think Tony can cut it while you're wearing it. Um, no. Here, you cut both sleeve off. Cut both sleeves off the sweater. All right, it might be a good idea to take that off actually, and then crop the bottom so your belly shows. So there no be so no undershirt underneath. Take it off. And Perry, I'll make sure you get a really nice sweater with the money you made from this. Okay. Need a hand. Thanks for not helping me. Yeah, because I don't want you to. Okay. When I when when I don't answer back, thank you for that. Yeah, it was a communication. Yeah. So Perry, cut the sleeves off this thing. Wait, it's not. not it's not like a. It's not like a real premium. Late. Check the label on that. Make sure it's not like Gucci or something. Or Brooks Brothers. I can't read without eyes. It's a uh, machine. Oh, that's garbage. Okay, yeah, let's cut that up. Yeah. Okay. You want the scissors? Hey, me eyes. God, I hate being old. Doesn't it stink? It sucks. Um, 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 let's see. Here, I'm going to hold the bottom. Hold the bottom, thank you. And I think you're going to cut up this way. Yeah. Hold that, hold that like that, yeah. See where my thumb is? Got it. This is 
the By the way, uh, a lot of people in the chat are already saying that they, they, they're buying their VIP tickets to the live show. And I, I just want to say thank you for that. There's a link to tickets again for the live show. And if, I'll tell you what, if people buy the tickets right now or today, uh, I think it's a great show of force for uh, PCL. Uh, it, it'll, show, it'll show the people behind the whole event uh, who's there to see Perry. So, and again, there's a lim limited amount of VIP tickets available. So if you want to get them... Oh, wow, com slash shop slash tickets slash Uncle Rico. We all want to see you guys there. I'm just impressed he had uh, really sharp scissors. I didn't know where they were. These scissors are machine shop scissors. Right, come towards more towards my thumb, I think. Uh, See where the seam is right here yeah. where these go. Yeah. Just angle it over. Yeah. And then I think we should go to this uh, black stripe here. Or you want to do the oh, white? white? White, okay. Yeah, you got to show some belly. Oh, nice. Were you? Did you used to work in garment? No, I worked. Uh, I worked uh, in metal shops. Oh, okay. Worked for my my uncle, who was a tool die guy. There you go. I'm a little kid. If you want, I'll put them back in the drawer. No, you are not touching. Just so you can get it on. I'm speeding it up. Nothing. Harry. Don't worry about it. All right. We can be auctioning off. His <laughs> this can be a nice skirt. Any yeah, of, that'll uh, work. That'll work for somebody. What? Perry, you want to wear this as a skirt? Shut the fuck up. It'd be pretty funny. Shut the fuck up. Hey, Perry, how many times do you want to just be a, 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 a gross, like, ingenuous host? <laughs> We'll save this. You got that. Oh, please. Stupid. Right, I'll put the sleeves well, on. Let's, let's move these. Yeah, excuse me for <laughs> talking like a... I'll wear these to uh, Burning Man next year. If you want that, that's your decision. Hold on, here we go. Pull it down. Thank you. This looks, <laughs> this looks ridiculous. That. This looks ridiculous. <laughs> I think it looks great. Oh, God. All right, and then after the stream, we'll just take it up and put it back in the drawer. Yeah. Forget about it. You're going to put it back in the drawer and just wear it some other time? No. We're, we're going to have storms all week, so I think this will be your rainy this day wear. This is not. This is not. Storm weather clothing anymore. This is stupidity clothing. Well, you're going to need a whole stockpile of those. No, no, I've already got a whole stockpile of those. They're on my freaking couch, and I want to get rid of them all. You can wear this as a skirt. That will never happen. Mm -hmm. All right, we got another mailbag on the deck? Yep, got one right here. Let him open it. Well, watch how he opens it, Terry, so you can take notes. Baby, I see that you're becoming a real ninja master with mm. your with your nunchucks. No. So I got you these throwing stars to defend no. yourself with too. If you practice, you'll be able to knock a fly off a man's. These penis. are not being thrown in my home. End of story over and out. Who are they from? Gina Macrano. These will never be thrown in my home. End of story. Over and out. You know. No. This is an apartment building. This is not a freaking uh, target practice place. Wait, are they real? Can we just open it up and just look at it without throwing it? Here, I'll open it. I will open it. They appear to be real stars. Yes. Have you ever used real stars? No. Oh. 
She's in the business of. Oh, is she? I mean. Only one coming out of the bag. No, you, here. You, only one is I'm coming. I'm not going to throw oh, them. Let go. I'm, okay. Thank here, you. I, I'm here to have a very friendly stream. Oh. Oh. They, they, they're not metal. No. They're, these can be thrown. Can we try throwing it at the tiger painting, maybe for practice? Oh, God. Yeah, we're... No! Fucking are, way! Are, what about the Tammy no! Faye photo back there? It's you don't care about that. Get out of no, 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 no. Turn, turn this shit off. I'm done. Oh, we're done. I, I'm done. You've just ended my career. Oh, we're your, done. Your, your okay. whole career. You are wow. Writing my fucking goddamn acting career out the fucking door. I'm tired of this abuse. Tired of this abuse. Fucking done. Perry, what did we talk about about your attitude? It's, I'm we... done being abused. How are you being abused? How are you being abused? Well, throw this over here. Throw that over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's a suggestion, Perry. You could say no without acting like a raging lunatic. You're not being abused. Stop it. You just got paid two hundred dollars for that stupid sweater. And you're, stop with the nonsense, Perry. And we had a long talk about your. Oh my God, you got serious back hair, Tony. You want to shave the back of his? Uh, his. Get out of here! Just turn around for a second. Just yeah. turn. No. Just, uh, he's not going to do anything. I just want to show it to the camera. Can you just turn around for a second? No. Perry, can you stop being a prick and just turn around for a second, please? Hey, I'm not right here. Perry, I'm here. Can oh you just God. get up and turn around? You see how he's all his hair and his ass neck here? Like, if you can so just... So what? Mind your own fucking business. I'm just I'm saying... Fed up. I'm just saying Tony shaved you before, but maybe he can just get that. No, know? he's not touching me again! I've gotten better. I don't freaking care. God, hey Perry, you can, you can. Hey Perry, we had a long talk the other day. Cause I, I'll tell you the truth. Stop, 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 stop talking over me. Stop. Excuse. I'm tired of you saying the word abuse when you're not being abused. So stop saying abuse because you're not being abused. You're being paid. This is your job. So stop bumping and darting. Stop making uh, threatening gestures uh, towards your guest, Mr. Hawk. Here, calm down, okay? Uh, we had a long talk the other day because, frankly, I. I'll wait. Till, I'll wait till you're ready to listen. I'm always ready to listen, okay. so keep uh, talking. Frank, frankly, I hated PCL more than Perry usually does. As of and and uh, Tony knows this. I told him. I I told Garrett. I told you. I said, listen, I don't want to put myself through that anymore. You were just out of control. Let me just. I want you. To, are you calm now? Can you take a couple of breaths? Because I want you to see something for a second. I actually took the time to put together a little compilation from Monday's stream. Okay, where you were kind of out of control, and sometimes I think you need to see how you get. Are you are you calm now? I'm I'm trying. Let me know when you are. I'm trying. Okay, I'm I'm trying. Right. Trying is the best way. Okay, I want you to see this, and just to see how you behave, because it's so hard for me every time you dart up and get away and want to shut off your computer like a child and all this stuff. So I, I and this isn't even the, a full compilation. Uh, this is just three minutes and change of Perry screaming and yelling. This is just from Monday. I could have I could have made this much longer, but I only picked these uh, little clips to show you. And I want you to pay attention to this. And maybe uh, Tony's there and he can give you some advice. But this this is how you come off on the screen, stream. And of course, keep in mind, you know, I'm three thousand miles away. I'm trying to direct a stream where the host is constantly trying to turn off his own show uh, every two seconds. You hear something you don't like, you dart away, and I can only do so much, and it just it takes a lot out of me. Okay, uh, so I just wanted to see how you are watching yourself. Okay, in your get off my fucking radio right now, you motherfucker! Get off my stream right now! It's what time? What time? What time? What I'm just gonna pause right there. This is something you do all the time. Like, this is one of the Perry. Like you're angry now watching this. I could see you getting like, whatever. Like, what's your thought watching this? What's my thought watching this? Yes. My thought is, uh, I feel sorry for the guy. 
for me, right? I feel sorry for me. I too. feel sorry for this guy that's yelling his ass off. Okay, well, you are in control of how you react to things. Now, this is what you do all the time. There's usually something around the desk area. It could be a stack of napkins. It could be a, a soda from a delivery. It could be a bag of something. It could be, in this case, it was a whole thing of trash. And you just can't wait to defiantly dart up and dump it out. And that's what you're doing right here. That's one of the Perry tropes of all time. Okay, so as we go on, I just want you to see how you come up. And by the way, people are watching this. Like, there's like... Uh, uh, 2,000 people, whatever, combined with uh, YouTube and Twitch watching this, and this is what they're watching, a host that's, this is the empty chair. That's what they're watching half the time. Okay, I'm gonna continue without further interruption. Fucking asshole! You motherfucker and all your fucking stupid shit! I'm leaving tomorrow, Wednesday. Thursday, Saturday, in the fucking snow! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck all of you! You fucking animals! I want to get out of here tomorrow, early. No, you're not, Perry. Fucking whores. Go fuck yourself! Good night! Good night! Good night! We're done, we're done, we're done, we're done, we're done. Turn that light back on, Perry. Can't wait to get started. Well, turn this light on. You don't even know how to turn a light back on, do you? It turns on like that. Fool. Fucking fucking motherfucker! Don't ever go that! Don't fucking ever go that, you fucking again! I'll fucking murder your ass! You son of a fucking bitch! Now you think it's okay to threaten to murder me? I don't even know if you were talking to me there, to be honest. But... I, I don't even know what I was. I, I I don't even know what I was saying or who I was saying it so to. So are you are you demonically because... possessed here? Is this like you're just possessed at this point? You're like the Hulk. I, I more or less. I right. Yeah. I, I I get out of control at times, and I have no clue or idea. Yeah, I know what is going through and, and, me. And here's the thing, Perry. There's a balance. And somebody just put in the chat that Perry uh, getting pissed off is the main draw. Tom B. Like, I, like I don't know that. I do know that. Okay, I know that you're you getting pissed off, but there's a difference between being pissed off and just being in an absolute rage for the entire stream and constantly trying to quit his own stream. And but here's the deal: you can't threaten to murder people, Perry, including the gentleman sitting next to you. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. I, I we've made up. Okay, just can we just <clears throat> stop with the murder threats? Can we work on that? I don't the think, word I don't, I don't, I don't think look, murder threats are the draw of the show. Look, 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 look. And, and please understand this. Being a child from the 60s, when your parents would always say, if you don't clean up your room, I'll murder you. If you don't wash the car, I'll murder you. You know, stupid stuff like that. That's why I talk that way. Okay, but you it's weren't saying that, it in that. That's not the context I'm that not you're using. I'm not saying I'm going to murder you, meaning I'm actually going to come at you with a freaking uh, uh, axe and, and a gun or, or – no, no, no. I get it, Perry. Listen. Listen, Perry. You're out of control when you when you're threatening to murder people. When, when you're when you're screaming, and first of all, when your parents say, "Hey, if you don't clean your room, I'm gonna murder." Now, I don't know about you, Tony. I never had parents that said they were gonna murder me if I didn't clean my room, even joking around. Look, you weren't a child from the '60s like I was. Uh, oh, so all all parents in the '60s uh, threatened to murder their not, kids? Not all parents, but I mean that was the talk back in those days. Hey, Tony Hawk, you better finish those vegetables, or else I'm gonna murder you. Yeah, no, that didn't happen. Oh, I know. We'll, we'll continue. We'll continue. Good night. We're done. We're no, done. we're not done. We're... No, we're not done. Computer is done. Computer is fucking done. You see, Perry, you get mad when you hear logic. Mother, you motherfucker! Get off my goddamn computer right now. We're done. We're done. You fucking cocksucker. It's fucking after fucking midnight. I can't handle it. I know, Perry, I know. You're mad because I can't handle it anymore. I'm sorry. All right, right there, that's the fake voice, Perry. That's the fake voice that I There's think. nothing fake about yeah, it, it, see my that voice. Part, the part where you go like this. That's fake. You're trying to deliberately what, what is so fake about Well, I'll explain to you for the thousandth and uh, twenty seventh time. 
Uh, it's fake because you're screaming so loud that you're deliberately trying to shred your voice to exas to to basically gas yourself and get out every last bit of energy you have in your screaming to make a point. That's the yeah, fake voice. Yeah, it's where I collapse. Right. That's the, okay. Yeah, that's the that's the fake voice. And you know damn well it's a fake if you voice. call it if you call it fake. That, well, that's your, not how you talk. Your voice right now. That's your opinion. No, it's not my opinion. That, how you're talking right now is your real voice. How you sound in that I'm clip. Because I'm calm right no, now. Right, but that's, I'm not going like this. Right, so you just faked it. That's a fake voice. Thank you for confirming. Because this is an ass. I can't even walk. You're going to fucking kiss my fucking ass. I will fucking kill you, you motherfucker. Oh, that's the second murder threat in one Stop right there. Freeze right there. Oh, my God. Freeze right there. Yeah, look right at yourself. There. Look at yourself. I, I'm, I'm, I, I didn't even see what I just heard myself say. I will fucking kill you. I don't hurt people, okay? That's just the way we talked. Oh, stop! Like, <laughs> like I barely hurt the guy. Okay, I. Tony, just you just made a, Tony. You just made a gesture, like, like, hey, uh, and like I will agree. Did I hurt you badly? Yeah. Are you hospitalized? No, but... Did you have black and blue marks all over Perry, your body? And I'll bring this up now. On New Year's Eve, when you had me here, did you punch me in the face a few times? Yeah. 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 Okay, so, Perry, you just went against... You just said I won't hurt anybody, and now you just... You literally... I, you, I you, admitted that I hit the guy. And you've hit me, I, too. I, I've been the brunt of your fury, too, and it's not okay. It's not okay to hit people. Like, let, let me explain something. Okay, let's say you're on, on live on the stage in Pottstown, PA at the Uncle Rico show, and you're on a panel with all I these people. Look, no, look, stop. Yeah. Stop. And somebody, says some, and somebody says something that you don't like, no matter what it is. Are you, are you just think you have free reign to just get up and hit somebody? No, I'm their guest. I, I have no free range at all. I am their guest. Let me continue with this. I have absolutely no range in any way, shape, or form to act like I am in charge of that show when I'm. You motherfucker! You sick son of a fucking bitch! Go to fucking hell! You motherfucker! Good night. We're done. We're fucking done. We're done! You motherfucking son of a fucking bitch. Turn the light back on, you baby. Son of a fucking bitch. I know. Call me all the names you want. Turn the light back on, please. Fucking cut, sucking son of a bitch. Do your job. What job? There's. What, 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 this fucking thing? The light will eventually come back on. The job that you're doing right now, Perry. And do you know how to turn on the light? Because I don't think you do. Yeah, the light it's comes on after you turn on. Well, you don't know how to turn on a light. Just like you don't know how to no, use you're Instagram. Wrong. Just like you it don't comes know how to on. Shut up, you fucking after. Perry, you're arguing with Tom B. from Monday. Okay, just can you... And, and the light didn't come on. You had to get up and turn it on. You didn't do it the right time. You had it, to get... This, you turn on this... Shut up and listen to me, please. Okay. You turn on the switch and it'll blink. And it's like one, two, three, maybe five seconds later, then the light comes on. Right. Uh, I get it, but you had to get up to do it a second time, and the light. I mean, I'll do it right now and, it, and show you no, how it how no, it is. No, I'm not looking for that. Uh, I'm just saying, in that particular clip, you thought you hit it, but you didn't, and you had to get up and hit it again. That's the point. Let me let me do it. To no, show it Scott. no, no, no. We're, we're, I, I want to get through this clip. Okay. Sucker, it's on. But I'm sure you've had a pickle from Denny's, and you've definitely had pickles from McDonald's. So which one would you say is better? I don't eat fucking pickles, you fucking stupid asshole! This is the only pickle I fucking squeezed, okay? This I've thing. heard otherwise. Fucking pickle, fucking pricks. I don't know what the hell is going on here. It's after midnight. I am wasted. Don't fucking tell me what to do anymore. I am done with that shit! I'm tired of this evil shit. I, I, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I am done. I am done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. You know, if there was a drinking game on Monday for how many times you said the words, I'm done, uh, there'd be like dead people. <laughs> like, like they would have drank themselves into a coma. Uh, Anyway, look, my point in showing you that is we were talking on the phone. I didn't speak to Perry on Tuesday, which is very rare. You know, we usually touch base the day after a stream. 
We didn't do that. I, you didn't call me. The only, in fact, I called you for two seconds to plug your phone in so I can get the footage that you filmed, and that's all. That's all I. And then I said thank you and hung up. Uh, I didn't talk to you at all on Wednesday, and I called Which you. Which was good. Well, good for me too, because you were the last person I wanted to talk to. And then right. we did touch base uh, yesterday for the first time. Uh, and we had a little heart to heart and I said that behavior, which you just saw shouldn't happen. Again. But of course, already today in today's stream, you've exhibited that behavior again. So I don't know, I guess I was wasting my breath. I don't know. I, I don't know what to say. Okay. I'm listen, we, made, we did make a compromise though. My, my point for bringing this up is not just to fill time. My point for bringing this up is. Perry and I came to a kind of an understanding. Please don't dart in the bathroom. Let the man use the bathroom. I'm not. Yeah, you know, he's doing his thing. Yeah, I know. When I was when I was in your apartment during Tom B Week, I was doing my thing in there, and I thought Perry was doing a stream, and he came darting in, literally in in the middle of me urinating, because he didn't trust me in the bathroom, and he was like, you know, like right on top of me. So let Tony do his thing, and he's back now. So. He just did. He just. Okay, I know, but you're darting, back. but you're darting over there when you're supposed to be doing your stream. I just turned my head, my God. Okay, listen. My point for bringing all of this up is, we came to an understanding, and Perry made a point which I will give him, and I again a compromise, like any relationship, whether it's a romantic relationship or a business relationship or a friendship. What's the secret to life, Tony? You know this with your wife. Compromise, right? I'm sure there's okay. things that you you go out with your wife that you don't necessarily like to do, but you know she, it'll make her happy, so you do it, and vice versa. That's how life works. Compromise, right? So Perry doesn't want to be on the air past six hours anymore. That's what he said to Please. me. Please, okay? Because I do, I do, I don't want to come off like I'm torturing you when we're trying to uh, do a stream. And you know what? Look. A, it, a lot of people want to send you messages and stuff, so I try to get them all out on Monday. That's why the stream goes on long, because we have content coming in and people who want to pay you, okay, to get their content out. So I feel obligated as the director to kind of move you along and kind of prod you in, in certain areas. Well, I'm not going to do that anymore. I'll make an agreement with you if you can handle your end of the agreement. You'll have plenty of time to respond. Put, put your hand down. Uh, you so I think and again I think the streams can go have been really long lately and that should be a once in a while thing where they go crazy long. Now Monday only once in a while. I agree. So once in a while they can go long, but on the average I will do my best effort and I know Jim's going to do his part where we're going to cap it at let's say a Monday. Now Mondays are premium stream. That's our like main event stream. This is like an ancillary stream. But, 4 p.m. to 10 p.m. See, that's the thing I don't like. You're not going to father time me. I'm going to be the official timekeeper, not you. So listen, there's plenty of times where this. I don't like. I don't like 4 p.m. starting and then ending off, ending up getting off the stream at two and two o'clock in the morning. That that was just fucking insanity to okay, me. Okay, I, I Perry, did you just hear me? I said I agree with you. It's it, it was a okay. lot on me too. I mean, I. I I've worked day jobs before, and I've even worked split shifts before. Split shifts, at least you get an hour break to take a nap in between your your six hour your eight hour shift as well as your four and six hour shift after the eight hour shift. I, 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 you've already lost me, Perry. Just just please, just let me just. No, I didn't lose you. you, you just... No, I'm telling you, you did lose me. I don't know. You go into nonsense. I don't. Again, please, just listen. Let's just stick to what we're doing. Let's let's stay away from metaphors, examples, and uh, other exam other things that you don't understand. Okay, let's just stick to the facts. He's going to turn me into a psychopath. Stop, Perry. <laughs> no, I'm trying I'm to listening. say that we had a, see you, you. This conversation should have been three minutes long, and you just drag it out. All I'm saying is, Perry and I touched base yesterday, and I, I didn't want to. Shit. All right, let me know when you're done. Just just playing, just just trying okay, to be let, cute. Let, let, me, just... let me know when you're done. Okay, we're done. We're done being stupid. <laughs> I don't think so. But okay, I'll continue. I, I said that's why I said the word we. Okay. We are done being stupid. Okay. Listen. I I've been through a lot in the past month, okay? I don't need to go into all my personal details. Okay, but you know, Thank I, you. I I lost my mother, I, all this thing. I'm not going to wear that on my sleeve like that's a you know, a thing that I'm going to no, carry I know. with me forever. I know. Okay. But 
when I'm working with you on doing a live stream, particularly on Monday, Monday is very hard for me and it's very hard for Jim. Okay, we're, we're dealing with media share, we're vetting stuff, we gotta do a lot of stuff behind the scenes. Plus, I gotta check in on you, make sure your energy is okay, uh, you know, direct you here and there, and it, it's a lot. So, to make it shorter for me, and by the way, I stayed on long after you signed off on Monday because just to detox. I, you That's know what I, blows my mind. What, you know Excuse when I signed me? off? I signed off at 7.30 a.m. my time on Monday. Is he a nut? Is he out of his mind? <laughs> Just listen. He's, he's insane. So listen, I have a solution to all. You might have signed off at seven thirty on Monday, but yeah, did I know. You, but you know why, Perry? You know why, Perry? Because I was so drained from you're, you. I was so. You're drained. young, and you have energy to be able to be up. That has nothing hours. to do with it, Perry. I'm a human being. It's got everything to do with it. No, it has. I'm telling it you, Perry. It has everything to do with no, it. No, Perry, don't tell me what uh, what what my disposition is on why I chose to stay on for uh, close to thirteen hours. Okay. Uh, it had nothing to do with energy. It, it was because like, you fried me and I couldn't sign off and just go to bed. I couldn't just sign off and whatever. So I just stayed on and, and a lot of people in the stream stayed on. You know, we did PCL after hours and, and it was nice. We did a lot of Q&A stuff. We talked and stuff and it was good for me. But it took me two days to recover from that. I was a zombie all day Tuesday. I didn't want to have anything to do with you on Wednesday. And I was actually thinking like, you know what? If somebody else can't do my job, I, I don't want to do this anymore because I don't get a lot out of this. Uh, you do. And when I talked to you last night, you know what I'm saying is true. When I talked to you last night, I said, Perry, we got to make some wholesale changes here. I don't, and I'm not saying that like, you should sit here and talk about the weather and be Mr. Calm. Of course, you're gonna, you have a temper. Of course, it's, that's, that's always the way. But I'm saying, don't take it out on me when you're Darting up, screaming at the top of your lungs, and, and all that stuff. That's the it's stuff never that. Your, look, I'm, I'm going to stop you right there, please. Let me and thank you for stopping while I opened my mouth and started talking. I, I wanted to freeze you for a moment. I don't ever want to hear you make the comment by saying that I'm to blame you because it is not your fault, Tom. You're, but you take it out on me all the time. Uh, of course, you've, you've done, you've done wait, it today. Wait, you've done it wait, today wait, 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 on this stream. When anybody, when anybody gets upset with two, when you have two people arguing, a husband, uh, two guys are arguing, or a husband and wife are arguing, he's gonna always say it's the wife's fault, or the, or the friend's fault, or the brother's fault, or the mother or father's fault. He's always gonna say that. I'm always gonna say that. It's your fault. Yeah, no, Perry, but it's not the way. It's not the way brothers. You're not. You're not doing it the way brothers do. You're doing it the way in the clips I just showed you, telling me to go f myself, screaming at me. And and by the way, I would love to get a guest host. I would love Tony Hawk. I would love if Jim could do it. If Garrett could do it. If Sam from Twitch can do it. Whatever. Here's the problem with that. Number one, uh, they don't have the setup that I do. They don't have the relationship with you that I do because, uh, you know, even like let's say let's say Jim wanted to do it. Whatever. You're, you would tell him to F off and shut down your computer, and that's it. I at least have a long-standing relationship with you where I can kind of ease you back in and let you blow off steam and know how to do that. You know, and that, that's, that's, what, that's the benefit that I have. Garrett doesn't have that. Nobody else has that. And it, so it, the, the point is, Perry, I know you're bursting to say something, but let's, let me get this out. The point, having a guest host would be great at some point, but we're not at that stage yet. That's the problem. So, I, Perry, I know you're bursting to say something, but I'm going to ask you to close your mouth, please, for, for the love of God. I know you're bursting to say something, Perry, but yeah, please close your mouth. I am. I know. So I just am. wait your turn. Wait your turn. <laughs> wait your turn. Okay, so that, that's my point. So I was just fried. And look, at, there's been other streams where I'm just like, hey, that was a brutal one. That was our, And plus, on top of that, and, and I'm sorry, I'm taking away time from Mailbag, but I'm just going to get it out. Uh, there were technical problems because our software decided to update itself and it was very glitchy. And I, I know, Perry, you don't That's have to worry nice. about that, but you don't have to worry about that. All you got to do is sit there. I may not have to worry about it. It's, 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 Perry, it's a problem for the both of us. No, it's a problem. But you're in charge of all that. Yes, Perry. And if you'd let me talk, it's a problem for me. Main... Let me know when I can go. It's a problem yeah. for me mainly because I know not only have to deal with software glitches and stuff like that to keep the stream going, plus I got to deal with you screaming at me. I got to look at all. I got to talk to Jim and go over all the offers and Tom's tips and things like that. And I got to make sure to play the comments and direct the pace of the show. 
Uh, so you make it so much harder when I'm trying to do all those things in the race. Anyway, listen, forget about that. Our agreement is I'm going to go out of my way to make the streams on Monday shorter. They won't go. I'm going to do my best to make sure you're looking at the clock right now. Why aren't you looking at me? The, uh, the streams won't go past six hours. I'll make sure that in the, in the range of four to six hours. Okay. Uh, and what I'll do is at some point I'm going to have to cut off people from like donating, which is going to take money out of your bottom line. Okay. Your, your savings will diminish because I'm cutting people that want you know, the reason I'm keeping you on, by the way, when you're on late, you're like, I want to go to bed is because people are donating to you. They're paying you for your time. And you know, if you wanted to push through that and be a man, that's great. But if you don't, that's fine too. By the way, shout out to Cass, uh, from, uh, Formerly a pedant with pajama pants. Now he's he's in your chat. He just said hello, Perry. Hello, Cass. Hello, hello. Follow, follow hello. Cass on uh, Twitch if you're not doing so already. He has great gaming streams. Uh, but anyway, here's my here's my deal. So I'll either raise the price of the the tips uh, as we go along, and I'll announce, hey, it's a last call, uh, whatever, uh, and, and I'll I'll do that for you. But in the meantime, you got to do something for me. You got to not be that animalistic. When it comes to me, I'm just talking about me. You can scream at okay. guys like Soviet goat all day long, okay? Whatever you want to do. I'm also going to give you a lot less... Uh... Shh. Perry, they can't hear. They can't hear you. Okay, if they if they, if they can't hear... Yeah, they got to... What's going on? My neighbor's dog is going haywire. Okay, is that more important? It's not more important, but I'm afraid that's going to okay, be... Listen, the anyway, listen. Here's what's the deal. I'm going to try to streamline Mondays a little bit, and we'll change things up just a little bit. I'm going to give you a lot less direction. I'm not going to be telling you, you know, even like at the start of today, you know, you're kind of going to be on your own now uh, with with certain stuff, and we'll flow the way it wants. But when you start freaking out, and you can't run, a, when somebody's sending in a tip comment, I tell you this all the time, don't talk over it. Don't dart away if there's a video playing that you don't want. I know he's nodding now because he's logical, but I'm, we're going to have to test this, Perry. So I'm doing something for you. You do something for me, okay? And with that, yes, we'll just uh, we'll move on with our lives. And the one thing I said to Perry, I said, you know, I drew the analogy. I know Perry doesn't understand analogies, but sometimes he does. Uh, when you get like, don't look at him. You know what I'm talking about. Tony yeah, knows okay. what we're talking about too. You get like the Incredible Hulk. Now, Now I'm talking to Bruce Banner. Earlier, there was the Incredible Hulk. There's no getting through the Hulk. But what happens in the movies, uh, in, the, in the Avengers movies? How does the Hulk return back to Bruce Banner? He relaxes, calms right. down. How does he do that? There's a trick to that. How does he do it? How does he do it? Do you know? No, I'm asking you, Perry. No. I, I don't remember. He looks at the Black Widow, Scarlett Johansson. Ah, yes. So you have a picture, right? Why don't you get that picture? I have two of them. Well, pick one. Both of them. No, pick one. This, this, this is going to take. This is going to take ten minutes now. It's not going to take ten minutes. It's just a couple seconds. Okay. okay show it. Show it. All right, that's that's the one you're choosing. Okay. So when you get into the uh, Hulk mode again, and I need you to come back down, I'm going to say, "Look at Scarlet. Have that on your desk. Look at Scarlet." Now you know what I think you're going to do. When you're in that, what do you think you're going to, is anything that's going to calm you down? You're going to look at Scarlet and be like, hey, you know what? This calms me down. We'll see. Because you know what I think is going to happen? Huh? I think you're going to be in the kitchen somewhere screaming at me to go F myself. And I'm going to say, look at Scarlet. And you're going to say, fuck you and fuck that bitch. I don't care anymore. I know you're laughing, but that's exactly what you're going to say. Oh, boy. Perry, I think you're going to start masturbating if you see that picture. <laughs> anyway, look, that's my that's my pitch, Perry. I just wanted to let people know in our little talk. So Mondays, I'm going to do my best, Perry, to not keep you up. I, 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 you only do it once a week, but if it's that taxing for you. And I, 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 believe me, like I'm going to say this too, and I'll say this on the air. And I think Tony will agree with this. Like We'll be real right now. You do get a lot of jabs left and right on this stream. I don't know if I, I can say that. I get more than enough. You do, you do, uh, and there's no taking that away. Like if I'm sitting in your chair, I mean, and, listen, go listen. On. I'm going to give you some props. If I'm sitting on your side of it, and I'm hearing from guys like Soviet Goat and Carl Nelsons, and they're 92 in me every two seconds, and this and that, I, I'm not going to like it either, Perry. But 
so I do I do put myself in your shoes. You do get a lot of shrapnel, and you most thank you most of the time handle it like a champ. But that's the stream. That's that's kind of what makes you you know uh, special. Like your, your hair trigger temper is kind of like uh, the radioactive spider bite uh, for Spider Man. It's your superpower. I'm I'm gonna just say this about this stream. Um, I feel like I'm the little guy on a construction site that is always the one that has to find a way to climb out of that humongous pile of brick that out of the middle of nowhere just keeps falling down on that little guy. He goes from one job site to the next. And now this means construction. He goes from one job site to the next and every freaking job site he goes to, there's a pile of brick over here. He turns around what happens? Right. It always falls on that know, little guy. Do you want to? Do you want to know the difference? Like, like the cartoon, and I'm the cartoon. Okay. Well, hey, you know what, Perry? You just proved that you can handle analogies. That's a good analogy. But you know what I'm going to say to that? The difference between you and that guy in your analogy? Talk to me. You get paid for every one of those bricks that falls on you. That guy doesn't. Okay. Actually, he does get paid for the, because no, he gets paid to do a job. He doesn't get paid right. for every little brick that that uh, that falls on him. You do. That's the difference. It's it's. Okay. And when I say this is your job, and you even in the clip that I played, you're like, what job? Like you still don't consider this like a real job, like right? No, no. This this is this is my job. Okay, so that's all I'm saying, Perry. Uh, no one wants to hear you sit here and talk about the weather and skateboarding. We'd have no viewers. Um, no, people oh, tune please. in. People tune in because you're hot tempered and everything like that. And I try to do my best to give people an entertaining stream where I direct the pace and things like that. But it, it's been very hard. Monday was very hard to the point where it I'm going to ask this guy a question right now. So you're not listening to me you at don't all. Mind? Oh, of course I'm listening to you. Is this is Can this I on topic? Is this is this on topic with what we're talking about? Sure. He said weather. I'm going to say weather. Your truck, what kind of truck is it? Is it a 4 by or is it a regular truck? It's a 4 by. Perfect. That's all I need to know. That's all I need to know. Um, fantastic. All right, so, that was, that was, so, so while I was talking to you, all this serious stuff, like that was in it your was, brain? How long did that take? Just a few seconds. Okay. Uh, because we... We'll be going to the snow, snowboarding, and we will get stuck snowboarding. Mm -hmm. Ow! Okay, great. I mean, so so that's that's all. That's 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 what you want to talk about, right? Like, the, the, yeah. so do you remember the last thing I said? What I was talking about at all? About the uh, what did he just say? about the money? Yeah, th this is your job, and you get paid. Yeah. you know, and yeah, you're right. gonna, you're going to hear things you I don't get paid like. paid to be Perry. stupid. You're going to hear things in life that you don't like. I hear things that I don't like. You know, there's things that Tony hears that he doesn't like. By the way, some guy right. earlier uh, right. said that, that they didn't like Tony Hawk, whatever. Crazy people. Like, yeah. Shake it off. Like the song, shake it off. Right. Okay. But now, on the stream, you can address it however you want. I'm just saying, when we get to that level where you're sh threatening to shut down your stream, you see what I got to do, by the way, to even get you on live. All the th it takes me a full half hour to like set this up. When you shut the computer off, it screws me up. Uh, and I'm just saying, can we dial down on you? I'm not, I'm not talking about how you relate to, to the audience or comments. I'm talking how you di directly relate to me. When I'm telling you to stop, you know, I'll tell you, and from now on, I'll say, hey, look at Scarlet. I'm talking, I'm not, I'm talking when you're screaming about something. I'm talking when you get into like the rare, rarefied air of extreme baby mode, where it's like, Fatiguing. Now I don't know. Maybe people out yeah. there like it. Uh, it's very fatiguing to me uh, it, it, to be to be screamed at uh, nonstop. No, I, I no, I, I understand and I agree. My God, I I wouldn't like being yelled at all the time. I mean, oh, granted, both my parents were were yellers. And... Okay, okay. Listen, we'll move on. I, that's the deal. Uh, we're going to try to make Mondays a little shorter, and there's different tricks that we'll do to do that. And I will announce on the stream, like, hey, this is last call if you want to send anything in. We've tried that before. 
and uh, or I'll raise the or you know you know how like uh, airplanes like r- airlines like raise their prices during premium uh, times. So maybe I'll just have to like double the price or something like yeah. that just to make it a little more. Uh, there you go. And you go. I'll work with you if you work with me, okay? Yes. And a lot of good things are going to yes. happen. This is going to do the live show. If you're tuning in late, by the way, Perry's big news is what Perry. The Uncle Rico live show at Pottstown, PA, May 13th, which is a Saturday. Right. Get your tickets at souljoes.com slash shop slash tickets slash Uncle Rico. This is going to be really the first time since PCL started to see Perry live. Mm-hmm. And if you get the VIP tickets, which are limited, uh, you will meet Perry and Tony. That's okay. right. And me and Jim and Garrett and uh, everybody else. Uh, Everybody's going to be there. What's that? I says everybody's going to be there. Everybody's going to be there. Yes. Beautiful. Uh, all team Scott PCL. Joe? Hopefully, Scott, everybody. Uh, oh, Scott's cool. more behind the scenes, but hopefully, everybody right. team PCL will be there. Uh, Can so, I before, use the toilet real quick? Use the toilet right in the middle of where you're promoting like a big show for you to get people to buy tickets. Oh. Yeah, why not, Perry? Dart away. I'll, I'll handle that as, uh, as okay. usual. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, just uh, I'll let, I'll let uh, okay. I'll, I'll talk yeah, for you. Do your thing anyway. Uh, Tony Hawk's gonna be on the bill. You can see him right there. Uh, it'll be fun. Yes. It's gonna be the first time that Perry's doing a live event. His first time on the East Coast ever. Uh, and uh, who knows? Yeah, it, it could be. It could be a fun time. Are you excited, Tony? <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm, I'm just reveling in what just happened uh, with your. Um... Are you surprised? No, no, not at all, not at all. But um, I started listening to you, and then you know, we got the truck talk. <laughs> well, I knew, I knew when he was, uh, I knew when he was uh, asking the question. There was ten percent of me that was hoping his question was going to be like, "Do you think um, what Tom's saying is true? Do you think I'm too much sometimes?" And I'm like, "Oh wow, he's really listening." But. 90% of me knew it was going to be about like some fake snowboarding thing that he wants to do. Like, uh, when do you want to go in the snow? <laughs> like, I knew that was going to be. I knew that was going to be. Yeah. Yes, fake no, I'm, I'm excited. I'm so excited about uh, the uh, Pottstown May 13th yeah, show. Yeah, and by the way, we've, we've never, all of PCL people have never been in the same room because I've actually never met Jim in person. I'm looking forward to meeting No, Jim, me neither. Uh, AKA Joey. Uh, and. The last time you and me were together was in Perry's apartment on your debut on Tom B. Yes. Right? Did I see you? Yep. No, I don't think I saw you after that. Uh, and that's, I think, the last time I saw Gary. Why as well. in the fuck do you say fake snowboarding? Because, you know. Because you're not a snowboarder. Because I've only been in the snow twice. And you were terrible. This season. And we saw the oh. and we saw the video. You're terrible. You don't know how to snowboard and you're not a snowboarder. So fucking what? It takes time to learn. Yeah, you don't have enough. There's not enough time uh, in, in the world for you well, to learn. Then fuck you. Then fuck okay. you. Wait, okay. wait, wait. Thank Hold you. on. I heard. Aren't you going to North Carolina to get your tattoo removed? No. Oh. oh, maybe we should do that live on stage at the Yoko Rico. No fucking way. Anyway, anyway, listen. No fucking I'm in way. the middle of I'm in the middle of pushing your you live event. You can say whatever the hell you want. If the arm is not being touched. Yeah, Perry, if you I know. Try what you can to fucking touch my arm. Then, uh, then we're done. No, then, we're not. Then we're done. Perry, hey, Perry, I will leave show you... business and everything. Oh, okay. Good. And I will poorer than shit. Perry. Do you understand? Do you see on the screen that I'm pushing this live show and you're just talking yeah, about Minutia? Okay, I know. okay, so stop. I'm not doing this. No, this we are, thing. Perry. I have a signed contract from you that you are. I don't you... give a fuck about that stupid contract. That I'm going to avoid the contract. No, you can't, Perry. It was signed. It was notarized. Okay, it's legal. So stop it. You, you agreed. To, you agreed to change it to streamer, which you will. So I don't want to argue about that. I know you're trying to be defiant and show your power. You're not doing that. The tattoo is going to be not removed. It's going to be changed. Okay, to streamer. Anyway, listen, here's the bottom line to everybody watching this live right now. Only at Shamrock. Perry, shut up. To everybody watching right now, if you get tickets today, it shows that you're there for PCL and everything, and it'll be a good thing to get the VIP tickets. You really want They're so cheap. They're only 40 bucks. Get the VIP yeah, tickets. They're cheap. And uh, we'll make it worth your while. We really will. So souljoes.com slash slap slash tickets to Uncle Rico. Obviously, this will be all over uh, Perry's uh, social media. And uh, we'll mention it on other streams. But it'll be great to see people there. Yeah. Okay. Um, 
Is there anything else I got to mention about that? I don't think so. I think it's going to be fun. I think it's going to be fun. We can all hang out. We can get like cheesesteaks or something. You know, we'll get some good yes. content out of it. Cheesesteak. Yeah. If you're lucky, maybe maybe, maybe Tony what? will sneak you some food from the first class cabin on the airplane. Yeah. What? I'm going to be in first class flying, aren't okay. you? Well, when I, you're going to be back in coach, so yeah. I can, you know, send you back some stuff. All right. Because I don't know how much McDonald's you can bring on the plane before. God the- damn it! I'm fucking done with McDonald's. Sorry, sorry. Done. Is no McDonald's on a fucking jet airplane. No McDonald's served to me anywhere again. I like- Fuck it, eh? All right, Perry. Was that necessary to dart back like that? Um, okay, so anyway, and uh, Perry's going to be on Bob Levy's uh, Out of the Coffin show uh, Sunday afternoon at 2 p.m. East. That's 11 a.m. Pacific. And then this Sunday? Sunday, yes, this Sunday, and also Sunday night, you're on Chrissy Mars' show. I'll put a link up for that uh, after the show's over. Uh, after this show's over, I'll also put it in the description on uh, YouTube. You know, it's funny, when, when I... I saw those sound issues at the beginning of the stream. I was like, "Oh no, I can't leave this on YouTube. I got to fix that and put it back up." But I'm gonna, I'm gonna not answer to the OCD in me, and I'm gonna just leave it up. Uh, you guys will figure it out. Uh, and so I'll put that up there. But that, you're gonna be on Christy Moore uh, Sunday night at 11 p.m. Pacific, 7 p.m. Oh, Eastern. Perry, can you just pay attention instead of doing whatever the hell you're doing? What? It, what is the, What are you doing? I have, I have finger problems. Okay, I have hand problems. All, all since, all right. since it gets the, very, uh, it gets very tiring to try to like promote everything for you because you can't do it for yourself. So can you at least listen to me while I'm doing it? Yes, go right ahead. All right, thank you. All right, we're gonna move on with our day. Uh, I know Tony's got to leave soon. Do you want to get another? But okay, you got a big mailbag yesterday that you were complaining about that you you wanted to throw away right at the post office. Why don't we get to that right now? That's the boat. Oh. It's not, do not open the box. Yeah, let's do, not, open it. do not open that fucking box. Do not open that motherfucking box. Out of the house only. After we open it. it we are not. Go. No. Right? We okay, open first it. Of we're, all, we're not opening the time box. Time out. T- t- time out, Perry. The box is not ever to be opened in my home. Perry. Again. Oh. The boat is never to be allowed in my home. Okay. Again. Okay, Perry. Ever. And fucking out. I'm if gonna... I see another boat at my mailbox ever again, it goes in the fucking trash. 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 Fucking trash. Never send a fucking boat. This sit down. Sit down. Never sit send down. this motherfucker to my mailbox ever the fuck again. Perry, sit down and, down and shut up. Sit down and shut up. Okay. Number one. Number two, here's what will happen never again. When you're yelling at Mr. Hawk here, you will not yell at him with a clinched fist like you're going to punch him. Okay, I've seen you do it with me, you do it with Garrett, and you do it with him. When you yell at somebody, do not... I yelled at him. Yeah, no, you just did. I just saw you. You, you clinch your fist like you're going to punch him. Okay, and I don't want that. That's what's never going to happen again, first and foremost. Okay, you're not going to be violent with somebody just because they hold a piece of mail that you don't like. Okay, that's that's no no don't don't look like I'm saying something that that uh, is, that you didn't just do. Did he just do that to you, Tony? I saw yeah, it. He did. Okay, you put you clench your fist like no not whatever. That's the answer of a child. No no idiot boy, I, I clench my fist because I have a circulation. No problem. no no, you clench your fist looking at him like you're going to punch him. So <laughs> stop with the excuses. That's what we're not going to do. Anyway. Let me see the boat, please. I'm not asking you to open it, but let me see it. What? But it's the same boat. That's like the official PCL boat, it's by the way. It is the official boat of PCL. The Explorer it's no 300. Longer... So? No, I'm just saying it's the official boat of PCL. Well, um, you can have it, Tony. There's a couple of things that we can do with this, Perry. Now, please join us. I don't know why you got to shoot all the way back there. Because uh, I let him sh- show the boat. So I can open it show it? Not in my house. All right, listen. Never in my apartment. That, bo- that This box is not to be opened in my home. If you open this box in my home, this stream is done. Done. The fuck? Done. I will shut the stream down. Whoa, whoa, we will whoa, end Perry Caramello whoa, whoa, live. Whoa, whoa. I will not go to fucking the East Coast. We're done. You got it? Well, thank you for not saying back to the East Coast because we know you've never been there. 
But uh, no, you're not going to threaten us, Perry. You're not. And this is what, the other thing we just agreed to. You're not going to threaten to turn down the stream. Everything you don't, anything time you don't like. And you're not threatening to cancel. You just did it already earlier. I said you're not going to do this because th this is what he's going to do from now until May 13th. He's going to say I'm I'm not going to do this live show every time he hears something he doesn't like because he's a child. Uh, you can't do that. We have a contract signed now. You're doing the show, so you can't say that I'm not doing that no, show. No, I yeah. Well, so you're going to calm down, Perry. Thank you. And here's what's gonna and here's what's gonna happen. And you're not gonna cancel Perry Caravelle live because you don't like a book. Now let's say somebody paid you. Now I'm gonna give you a hypothetical. Since you were able to handle a hypothetical on your end, I'm gonna throw you a hypothetical. Let's say hypothetically, somebody sends you, I don't know, five hundred dollars if you would blow up the boat and show it. Because it, it did I'll tell you what the boat did serve as a good purpose for. It did, uh, it did serve as a good purpose to cover your horrible blinds when there was light blinding in, you know, uh, when we were doing the evening streams. Now the light's fine. But when we do it in the evening, uh, it was a good shield for that. So I'm saying, what would you say to that if somebody said, hey, I'll pay you X amount to keep the boat up? Uh, I, I, I disagree. Well, I'm just saying, what would you say if somebody wanted to pay you money? thousand dollars or, okay. or more uh, so there's room for negotiation bucks is a joke okay room for negotiation you could also bring it to bob levy's with you the man has a pool allegedly that's going to be then, there. then then uh tony can take it to bob levy's i don't i'm not touching that thing again okay anyway thank you was there a note with that that was just sent as is right there was no there was box. Just, just it was just put in the mail and and i picked it up okay. from the why don't box. we just find a quiet yeah. place for that to reside for now we won't open it that's going to home to Tony. No, no. I'm putting it over here underneath the... Yeah, uh, let's just put it where it's out of the way. And Parrot, you only have to keep it there for like you a, can a, put a, it. a little while. Right there. Right. He's got a great place. Right there. Not hurting yeah, anybody okay. right there. That's it. And hey, hey, Tony, while you're there, because Perry is too lazy to do this, can you please clean that stuff off that dog? Can you just put him in the sink or something like that and just yeah. like rub that stuff off? It's like He's not allowed to touch the dog anymore! I yeah, I want to rub that stuff off. It's a beauty. Then you take it home no, with you. I I'm, no, you're not. Stop. I, I have to go. Let me just clean up. What's his name? It's the official dog. He's going to get no fucking water everywhere! Get out of my house! No, he's not. Get out of my house! Out! Of my house. That, that that washes off. Yeah. That paint. Oh, I didn't realize that that paint washes off. Go, go. Yeah, Perry. Sorry. This is what you should have done. Yeah, Perry. This is, this is what I asked you to do weeks ago. I didn't realize that that paint washes off in water. You didn't realize that I, even though I told you that every single time I asked you to do no, it. You didn't. No, I didn't. Yes, I did. I said it washes off. Didn't it wash off of you? Of course it washes off. It's temporary. You left it there because you're lazy. Whatever. Whatever. The answer of a No more comments. No more comments. Oh, you're just going to be quiet for the rest of the stream? Just about. That's good. I'm glad everybody tuned in for this. Look at that. Look at that, Tony. Uh, Tony, are you, a, are you a pet groomer as well, in addition to being a famous skateboarder, inventor of snowboarder and skate parks, and a body hair remover? Definitely. I, I've definitely done some service at a Petco, washing uh, dogs and clipping nails. Right, Perry? You should have listened to me. I shouldn't have had that pink on me for that long. And you know what I? You know what? You know what I heard, Tony? I heard that you uh, that you and your wife do hair too for celebrities. Yes, we do. Never touching my fucking hair. Because Excuse me there for is, swearing there, again. There is there is a crowd source on the table for Perry to uh, to go with that uh, pink dye, but more uh, on a semi permanent basis. Maybe you're the guy. No, to do that. thank you. Perry, no, I, thank you. I have seen Mr. Mr. Hawk. Not going to happen. Not going to happen. It's not going to happen. Tony's grandfather, it's L not, Luigi Hawk, in the barber chairs, used to do all of Sicily. Not yes, going to happen. He did it, Perry. I don't care. Look I look. No, look, look, look at me. It's, it's Rufus. I'm You're going to call this thing Rufus? All right, I'm Randy. Randy says... They used to then, go, then, then you and Randy get the fuck out of my house. Look, bye. Harry, we're out. gonna talk about Goodbye. it. Look, out, 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 it out, is out. eleven o'clock, and Tony has to go. Good, but here we'll talk about it next time. And a hair job, not a hand job. No a hair, hair job. job. You're not touching my hair. God Almighty.
Oh anyway, my God! Thank you, Tony. I know you got to go. Are you gonna head off? I do. All right. Let's say goodbye to Tony Hawk. You want to keep that, All by right, the way, you, as a as a memento. What? You want to keep? Oh that? yeah, please, please. Keep I would those. love to. I'm gonna wear. Take your bag. Take I'll get, your bag. Get my bag. And Tony, hey, listen. We'll probably see you on the stream between now and uh, May 13th, but we'll see you in Pottstown. I'll see you in Pottstown, PA. Yep, definitely. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for having me, everybody. Perry, so excited to be hitting the the road with you. Okay. Boom. Let me know when you want to go snowboarding. And we'll go snowboarding go. before then. Yeah, oh, Tony, yes. can you can you grab the tiger photo and bring it over here before you go? Oh, no yeah. fucking way! He's not touching that goddamn picture. Open the door, walk out. But open the door and walk out. Yeah, what was Bob talking about, boss? <laughs> this is. Here, bring it to the stream. Show the stream. Stupid. Fucking stupid. There. There she goes. Put it in my chair. Why is it that Bob keeps sticking this this little portion over the nose? I could see what he's, I could see what he's saying though when I yeah. look at it. Yeah, that looks like okay, okay because he's a pervert. All right, just put it here for now. Tony, look, why don't I'm you take it with you and fly it in first class with you? You're not touching my picture. All right, I'll see you later, Tony. Thank you. No. Leave it there. Leave it there. If that's a delivery, if that's a delivery, bring it in. Maybe there's a nice beverage or you know a little sandwich, Perry. You know, because just when you thought you were out, Tony, the McDonald's pulls you back in. Uh, make that. That's for you. This is for you. Oh, thank you. All right, this will be great. There's an iced coffee for you. Look at that. Thanks. Everybody wins. Everybody wins. All right, now I'm really going. Get out of here. All right. Bye, Tony. Hey, wave to the wing camera on your way out. I got it set up. Wave to the camera outside. And they sent me another, another deluxe breakfast. Bye, Tony. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> All right, what you got? Another deluxe, like I'm, like I'm gonna a deluxe breakfast and a bunch of, um, you know, knife, a fork, plastic edibles, and syrup and stuff. What are you darting off to? Shut and lock in the door, because I don't want anybody coming to my door again. Fair enough, fair enough. All right, I'm going to just call it right now. I think we're going to go above our three hours uh, today. No, we're not. No, we are not. <laughs> no, we are not. Compromise, you know, we had an announcement to make. We had a guest. I haven't gotten to one co tip comment today yet, so it's going it, to – I think – Let's just maybe think about going a half hour over. I don't think that's uh, that's bad. And here's the other thing I'm just going to say, and this is to the audience, to the people viewing, to the people that send in like tip comments. If we don't get to it in this stream, it'll be carried over to Monday. Okay, I think that's uh, I think that's fair. And in the same thing with Monday, that'll be carried over. We don't get to Monday, we carry over to Friday. Unless it's media share, then we'll carry it over to the following Monday. Okay, I want to be fair to everybody. Oh shit! Can you move that bag out of the way? It's right in the middle of the frame. Thank you. By the way, I'm already getting a ton of message, Perry. I don't know if this makes you happy. A lot of PCL people are buying those VIP tickets to see you live in Potsdam. Oh, thank you. Thank you. That's very nice. I'll put the ticket information up there again. Anybody who's joining late, souljoes.com slash shop, shop slash tickets slash Uncle Rico. Get the VIP tickets because that's the way you're going to meet Perry in person. And he's going to, you're not going to, you're not going to kill anybody, right? Or punch anybody in the head or anything like that. You'll be really nice. 
take photos. Am I a guest? I'm a guest. What does and that mean? It means once be again, very like others. If you're joining late, Perry's going to be part of the Uncle Rico Show live with stand-up featuring Bob Levy, Shuley, Mike Morris with special guests, Anthony Cumia, Casey Armstrong, Mike Puchetti, Vince the Attorney, Cardiff Electric, and our own Tony Hawk. And the great – look Look on this poster, Perry. Look what they did for you. Does any of these other people get you, – your name is in color. You have the biggest name on the whole poster. And the great Perry Caravello. Does that make you happy? Oh, that's an honor. And they didn't spell that's your name wrong. Honor. They didn't spell your name wrong or anything like that. Yeah, that's like that. serious honor. Okay. So there's, yeah. all different, there's all different levels of ticket prices, but definitely. Um... Cold freaking hotcakes. I hate cold hotcakes. Ugh. That looked like a uh, hash brown or whatever. whatever well, I mean, cold, cold hash mark, okay? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, by the way, uh, let me ask you a question. What have you been eating this week on your own? Stuff in my house. Have you had any fast food? No, trying not to. Because you do have a deal with Bob Levy that he's going to quit smoking if you quit fast food. Now, of course, I'm going to say to Bob, the stuff he gets on the stream doesn't count. That's part of the stream. It's his off days that count. Right, Perry? Yes, sir. So you haven't had any fast food. I haven't talked to Perry this week, so I haven't. Is... I haven't been. I haven't basically stayed at home. Right. I'm being, I'm being old, and it's very sad. Well, you did say yesterday that you went grocery shopping and you got sushi the other day, which was good. Yes. Yes. So that was good. So no fast food this week. Okay. So so far you've kept that. That's good. Okay. Anyway, guys, I'm going to take the thing down. But remember, get your. a lot of people have already been messaging us about that they're really excited. A lot of fans that I've uh, seen on in the chats and stuff that's saying that they're going to come. It's going to be really – isn't it going to be fun to put names to faces, Perry? Like if, let's say Soviet Goat yeah, shows finally. up and other people. Sure. Soviet Goat and Carl Nelson if they show up. I will be very disappointed if Scarlett's not there. Yeah, Very disappointing. I will say, I, I normally don't do this. Uh, I had to pull this out of my back pocket. Perry did not want to go to this thing. And I was talking to him yesterday. He's no, like, I didn't. I was like, I do not want to go to uh, Philadelphia. I am not interested in flying. I am going to be harassed. And uh, what was the other concern, Perry? You didn't want to leave your I, apartment? I, I didn't want to leave the area. Well, yeah. I don't want somebody breaking in. I don't want... Uh, I don't Exactly. Want I don't want to be harassed at the airport. Right. <laughs> if, if there's fans at the airport, that was a concern. Uh, well, Garrett's going to be with you, so it'll be fine. But anyway, so I normally don't like to buy into his uh, fake uh, Instagram uh, female uh, addiction, but I did tell him that Scarlett might be there to get him to say yes. And what did you say when I said Scarlett might be there? It'll go. Yeah, that was what that's what that's what put him over. <laughs> so I had to use a cheat code. I was very disappointed in myself, but I didn't have an hour uh, to uh, get Perry to do it because I had. A, I mean, uh, I know I got other girlfriends out there other than the the the, the three female celebrity fans. Of, well, fan, fans of mine as well as friends of ours, meaning Jennifer Aniston, Scarlett Johansson, Gina Carano, including the She Hulk, and there's others out there as well. Um, I just don't want to start a problem, but most of them live over here on the West Coast. Hey, by the way, any female fans that are into she hope cosplay, uh, you might be in for a wild ride if you show up in Pottstown on May 13th, so just throwing that out there. That will be fun. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, and we'll see if we can maybe do a live stream like that weekend. I don't know how we're going to pull that uh. off because we'll all be on the road. But uh, maybe we can jump on. Uh... Did that taking that thing of water just gas you? No, I, I uh, had food stuck in my in my throat. Oh, okay. Well, maybe slow down. Um, so maybe we can do some kind of like cool. at least go live somewhere like over that weekend. Maybe I'll I'll try to figure that out. So for people that can't make it, but hopefully everybody does. Oh, what? So you're going to try to make two shows happen? No, I, I would like to. We're not going to do a stream that Friday, okay? Because you'll be traveling. You'll probably right. or, already right. be in. in uh, 
You're going to be. We I should be. Go ahead. We go should ahead. be in PA by Thursday, correct? You're going to travel on that Thursday. Okay, I'm traveling on Thursday. All right. Yeah. Yeah. And I know, Garrett, you wanted to know what the travel date was. That's the travel date. It's going to be Thursday for sure. Okay. Uh, somebody in the super chat just sent in 20 bucks. Wow. Greedo the Green says, money for Tom B and Tom B only. And you, Perry, a gay Hulk 92 edition. Oh, thank you, Greedo. That's really nice of you. Yeah, maybe Bob, Bob Levy did suggest that um, we could possibly do something by his pool. So if I can, if I could figure out a way to get on Perry Caravo Live, we will. We, we just uh, committed to this yesterday, so there'll be a lot of planning between now and then. I'll wait till you finish. I, I know I haven't played one uh, comment or anything. I'm just waiting for Perry to eat before we actually start the stream. Stream's almost over. No, it's not. Got another hour, hour and a half. No, I know, I know. But people are anxious for their tip comments to, to come up. <laughs> and uh, obviously we had an announcement to make, we had a guess, so you know we're a little behind. I will get to them. Oh, and, Jesus. I'm just waiting for Perry to eat, finish eating. Wait, another three or four more bites, who knows? And we're gonna be in a good place now, right, Perry? Me and you, we're gonna be fine. Like going through this and, and working together, right? There's me no screaming at me. You mean today's stream, or you mean I, going? I mean going, going forward. To the PA. I mean everything. Yeah, of course, always. Not always, no, not always. I played you the video of Monday night, which uh, was far from always. I'm just saying, I don't want to do this anymore. Like you know how you say you don't want to do this anymore. I don't want to do this anymore. If it's gonna be like that, okay? I don't. I hear you. And you I and, hear you. and let's you know talk in Turkey here. You need me a lot more than I need you. So I, that, that I agree. Okay, so so make it easy for me. Okay, if I'm not if I'm one that's sitting here not getting anything out of this, uh, at least at this point, uh, you can at least cut me a break. Okay, that's all I'm asking for. Then stop hunting for a snake. You know, snake break. Ah, it's very funny. How far are we away from uh, killing this uh, breakfast? We're done. Was that everything in the back? I'm not eating the hash browns because they're cold. And that's, every, that's the rest of everything. So, okay. yeah. That's fine. That's fine. I'm sure you're grateful to whoever sent this, right? Thank you very much. Yes. It's Tammy Faye. I love being hung up in the PCL studio. Can you please give Tony Hawk a kiss for me when you're in bed together? Slip him some tongue. Oh, you're disgusting. That'll never happen. Absolutely never gonna fucking happen. Oh, sick fucking bitch. It's Wavy G. You like tigers? In Cincinnati, we have the Bengals. The gathering of protesters here is getting huge. Better come to Cincinnati soon. Not going to happen. Uh, if I go to Ohio, I go to the Hard Rock in Cleveland. I don't need to go to Cincinnati. Not interested. Hi, babe. Dan Isaac told me the story about you taking a shit in your pants and then grabbing it and showing all the kids at Baskin Cool. What the f- Scarlett, come on. You've heard the stupid story over and over and over and over and over again on my stream. Don't believe that Dijak douchebag, okay? Whatever he's telling you is a complete lie. <clears throat> That's why I do nothing with him. Hi. Why would you show your crap to kids at Baskin? Why are you so mean to Tom and Mole and Don? Love you. I'm not mean to Tom. Well, I have been mean to Tom. The other two dirtbags we're done with.
Thank you for subscribing. The next time you yell or grab Hawk, I hope he beats you up. In the meantime, stop crapping in your pants. Whatever. You're in my home. You do as I say. It's my home. Not his home. If I'm in his home, I abide by his rules. In my home, you abide by my rules. As your attorney, I was notified Baskin may file a lawsuit against you for showing your turd to me lunch tomorrow and we can discuss. I'm not buying you anything ever, ever again. God. Mm. Ethan Ralph. You going on Chrissy Mare show? Well, I already walked off that skanks show months ago. Of course some simp like you would go on that show. It's a great show. I'm looking forward to being on there. <clears throat> Excuse me. Chrissy Mare here, please pair bear protect me from Ethan Ralph and his gross bifurcated gunt. I'm scared of him and need a man to protect me like you. Chrissy, dear, I have no clue who this person is. He's just a freaking fan. But I will be on your show on Sunday and we'll talk. All right, thank you. You? Bone the grieving widow majestic. You used Sheba as a meal ticket. You miss RC. You jack off thinking about him slurping you like a vacuum. You are disgusting as well as a freaking liar. So stop bringing up all these negative, despicable, evil, gross things that have been. The most despicable, gross things that have happened to me in my past. Okay? Stop bringing it up. Fucking assholes. I'm sick and tired of this negative, evil, demonic bullshit. Ugh. Chrissy Merrigan. Please, Perry. Can you look into the camera and tell Ethan Ralph to leave me alone? Let him know you are the boss and not him. Love you. Ethan Ralph, did you just hear that comment? I'm the boss, not him, not you, you scumbag. Leave Chrissy alone. Got it? Do they, if, Chrissy? Do you know this Ethan Ralph uh, personally or something? Or face to face, because I, I I don't know this guy face to face. We were notified by your own attorney Dan Isaac that you terrified kids at our store by defecting in your shorts and taking it. Be in touch. What in the hell? <sighs> Just be quiet. Why would Baskin Robbins give me a hard time? Wangler. Just 
I'm not interested in this. Mm. Moronic L's. Tom B. Appreciation Time. Perry, you need to be nicer to the man who takes care of your every need. Also, stop absolutely Tony, you stooge. Look, look, I, I kindly and constantly am honored and very thankful to Tom Brennan. I mean, yeah, and, and but but the the Tony kid that was just here, excuse me. Um, I, I I'm thankful for uh, you know the beautiful snowboard that he gave me, um, and uh, we'll be in the snow soon. That's all I know. I just know right now that with with this massive, massive downpouring of snow and rain we've been having lately which is actually an honor for the state of California. I mean, yeah, it's it's going to be uh, a detriment because there's a, like a freaking ton of it all falling all at the same time. And it's damaged a lot of properties and stuff. And, and a lot of businesses it's destroyed too. But um, in, in the long run, California needs this rain. So uh, let it come, let it come. Uh, by the way, Perry, I just noticed uh, you've been belching kind of out of control, and there was a, a belch-related offer here. I had to kind of like uh, not pay attention to offers uh, earlier because you know, we were busy. But uh, I'm going to say no to this one personally because I just think it's going to be impossible to do because you burp so much. But I'm just going to say it anyway because it's from uh, a friend of ours. Matt C. is offering Perry $40. For ev after every time you burp, if you could say thank you, Randy, uh, for the rest of the no. stream. No. Well. No. Never, never will I do go that route. Ever. I, I just think you burp no. so much that it would be like near impossible. So I'll say no for that. Uh, anyway, our friend Pat, here's one you can do. $20 to feed the dry dog food to your dog. I'm not. Oh God! Right, but Perry, you get twenty dollars. It's a stuffed animal. Okay, uh, it's a little bit of pretend at play here. It's stupid. I understand that, but all you gotta do is take a little bit of dr uh, dry dog food in your hand and say, "Here, dog," and feed the dog, and you get twenty dollars. So I mean, oh God! Couldn't be easier, buddy. Couldn't be easier. The dog gets thrown away at the end of the stream. No, it does not. No, it does not. No, it does not. And no, it does not. No, it does not. Perry, no, it doesn't. You can say it all you want, but no, it doesn't. Here's the knife. Oh. You want to show what you're doing on stream, by the way, because nobody can see this angle. I will cut into the top like that and reach my hand in. And then the dog food thing goes in the garbage. Shit. This is a thick... Eat. Manja. Let's see it. Let me get a good visual of it. Show the can't. Oh, oh, Christ. Right. Manja, you here? You want the, the, the dog doesn't want to eat. So. Very good. Very good. All right. Um, that's done. Let's see what else. All right. Uh, 
missed this one. I this one said eh, okay that that moment has passed. I'm going to ignore that one. Um, here's Big Pat. How about twenty bucks to tape a ninja star to your belly button? One of those stars you got. I don't even know where the stars went. Oh my god! You just opened because Tony Tony just took the thing and I don't know where he put them. You see, it's got to be right in the vicinity. You would have to imagine, right? No, it's it. Did you throw it away? That's what I'm looking for. No, I don't know where they went. All right, we'll move on. Listen, I don't want to get bogged down in offers today, so we'll move on. Let's sit down. Uh, we'll save. We'll save most offers for Monday. Uh, here's a Tom's tip. Remember, all proceeds of Tom's tips go to Jim and Garrett. And it's in, these are important. The Tom's tips going forward between now and the live show because. You know, I was able to get two tickets uh, for uh, Perry and Garrett, uh, plane tickets, but I would really like Jim uh, to come up as well. And, you know, uh, I don't think uh, Jim should have to pay for his uh, own ticket when he's going to be a big help and a resource to us because he's part of Team PCL. Whenever you're done, Perry, I'll continue. Well, go on. Keep talking. I'm just saying I would like Jim to come with us to uh, Pottstown because then that would really complete the PCL family. So, are we as uh, Perry Caravel alive? Are we do we have the funds to uh, get him up well, there? Yeah, I just I don't want to have to spend out of pocket to f fly up our people, but I think he'll be a big asset. And I also didn't want to get greedy in the negotiations with this to ask for every plane ticket under the sun. But anyway, but sending Tom's tips will help in getting him to uh, the show. So I'm just saying that'll be a good thing. So this okay. is the first Tom's Tips of the day. And it is from your friend Bruce, the Albertsons manager. Was that your manager at Albertsons? When yeah, you there? yeah, he was. Okay. When you're done bopping. I'll, what does what Bruce I'll, I'll want to I'll say. tell you what Bruce wants when you stop bopping. Talk. Uh, for everyone watching this, Perry used to have way worse anger issues working at my store than he ever did on this stream. Is that true? I find that hard to believe. I don't know what he's talking about, so let's hear what, let's hear what he's got to say. Well, he's saying that you had worse anger issues back then when you worked at the store than you do on the stream. One of the biggest reasons people reported him to me aside from sexual harassment of the meat man, Alfonso, was Perry used to get complaints from customers and co-workers about his offensive odor and poop fingers he oh, always seems to have. Oh, please. Please. They're just joking with me in the stream. Give me a freaking break. Perry always had poop-glazed hands no matter how many times I helped him clean up through a simple shift Baloney, 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 baloney. When a woman and her daughter complained about it, Perry clawed into her face with his poop fingers and said, Lie, die. lie, lie. And said, oh, die, oh. you effing bitch. I hope it gets infected, you effing C-word bitch. If he wasn't... What? Well, that's what apparently you said to the woman and her dog. I never said anything like that to any woman in my, in my, in, I'm going to say in my grocery store that I worked in. If he wasn't playing with his feces or downright eating it in front of people, he was doing insane, demented right there, assaults. Right uh, there, that's a freaking lie. Insane, right there. Insane, demented assaults like that to customers after digging his fingers into his butt. Uh, the grocery workers union could only get him out so many of so many jams before we had to transfer him to the Westminster location. Sincerely, Bruce, the Albertsons manager. No, no, that's an absolute lie, way beyond belief, way beyond belief. Thank you for subscribing. Again, thank you for subscribing. Frenny, it's me, Satan Caravello. I'm excited for you to come to Cincinnati. Chili is on me. Never. Filio fish is on you. Hail me, Never. Satan Caravello forever. Never. Never. Franny, why did you try and massage Corey's prostate when he stayed over? 
He trusted you and you tried to molest him. Is this another Randy situation? You... What the fuck are you talking about? Sick, disgusting bastard. That guy, Corey, that stayed over with you a few years back. He slept on the couch. So what? And then I took him to the airport. I'm not, not the airport, to the bus station. The Marines like to go on the Greyhound. So. Perry. It's Wavy G Big Fan. It's pandemonium in Cincinnati. The peaceful protest has turned violent. We're rioting in the streets. Come to Cincinnati. I used to have a band that I used to, uh, I think it was Black Flag, ride in the streets. Oh no, Circle Jerks. Ride in the streets. Running, running, ride in the streets. No. Anywho, um, I'm not going to Cincinnati. I have no business in Cincinnati. I'm not doing a comedy show in Cincinnati. No, I'm not coming to Cincinnati. And there is no fucking way, if I ever do show up in the fucking city of Cincinnati, that I'm going to see a fucking fillet of fish. Let's, 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 let's start over. There's no way, if I ever come to Cincinnati, that one, I go to a McDonald's. That two, if McDonald's is sent to me, I eat a McDonald's. Because three, McDonald's is not allowed in my vicinity again. Got it? I am tired of this garbage. End of story, over and out. Thank you for subscribing. Jerry Springer is looking to co-host your stream when in Cincinnati. Springer, Chili and Vallejo Fish, all while hosting the After School Satan Club. God almighty. I hate Vallejo Fish, and if I'm going to eat chili, uh, I would prefer it not being Wendy's chili. I would prefer it being my homemade uh, Shelby chili. It's Corey. I've been having a lot of flashbacks about you grabbing my thighs under the blanket while watching oh, the movie. Oh, get out of here! Going to the cops. Get out of here, you sick psycho! What are you back in the are you back in Los Angeles again? I mean, you you're back in the valley again. Thank you for subscribing. The Great PCL Riots of 2023. Help. It's your fault, Barry. A cop tased me so I threw a molecule at him. Come to Cincinnati. Watch Ghostbusters. LLLL. Out of your mind. Watch Ghostbusters. What the hell? For what? Well, the rain stopped temporarily. Expect more rain coming soon. Yeah, rain's starting soon. That's what it's good. All right. So what's what's up next? Thank you for subscribing. Okay, Pete, thanks for subscribing. Mohawk Kittles. Thanks. Perry, it's Dennis Wolf. I'm opening a new all-male brothel called The Dude Ranch. Love for you to be our celebrity spokesperson. What? Where is this? I'm not going to some 
Dude Ranch. Come out to Reno, sample some of our prostitutes. We brought in beautiful men from all over the world. Nothing is too good for our new spokesman. I'm not interested. I'll go to Reno to go snowboarding or snow skiing. I'm not interested in your stupid prostitute sting. No, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not interested in catching a disease, whether it be AIDS or any other stupid disease. No, thank you. Oh, you leave if I smoke weed? What are you, a gay homosexual right-wing fascist? Go on Steven Crowder's show. No room for your bigot ray on mine, Speedy. What the fuck? Good to see you, Rogan, but uh, I, I don't know what the hell you are talking about. I'm going to go on somebody's show that, that you're opposed about? That's your opinion, okay? You could say whatever the hell you want, all right? Uh, you're not putting me on your, your stream or your show, so, I mean, and you're not going to be, <clears throat> I mean... And I'm and I'm here. Here's the fear I have if I go on your show, Mr. Joe Rogan. You put me on your show, and you're gonna have those other two assholes that I used to work with show up, and they're gonna fuck with me. Out of the question. Out, out of the question. Perry, baby, would you consider marrying me? I want to propose to you in person and spend the night in you do your one bedroom apartment. I need you, Perry. Cameron, are you serious? Well, shoot, come on over. Let's even, I'll even have you on the stream. Come on over. Not today. It's Friday. It's all, the stream is almost over. We got about another hour or so to go. Unless you're in the area. If you're in the area, then uh, hop over my, my, my uh, uh, patio. Um, <clears throat> over the patio, knock on the, the door. If you know which patio to knock over. Not knock over, but I mean, you know. Hop over and knock on the door. Anywho. Weather time, it's messing hey, with buddy. my neck. Dave Grohl wants to do 102 barbecue, but I'm thinking maybe we open an Italian joint called Parm Springs. Which do you prefer? What? Why would you want to... I'm not interested in your stupid name for a, for a fantasy restaurant. Okay. And Dave Grohl's uh Dave Grohl in the, in the um uh I can't I can't I just forgot the name of the band. I just forgot the name of the band. They're guy they're guys from here in Encino. Not far from where uh, Whitney Cummings lives. Um Oh shoot. I think like Green Day. Anyway. Any anyway. But um, <clears throat> not not today, okay? Not today. Real ninety two story from Randy six girls were going to file charges. Six I called Perry said, "Get down here!" Everyone was pissed at me, Randy, for casting you for a shoot. Why are you? Why would they be pissed for? This guy casting me for a film shoot. What? Because we were just extras on a film set? Over a hundred people there? I mean, I'm one of I'm one minus a hundred, meaning there's ninety-nine more people there. Men and women. I was I was a doctor. There were a lot of nurses standing on that billboard ad. Okay? You said on my way you'd get down here, you freaking out, crying. I'm so sorry. I know I fucked up. I'm so stupid. I'll do anything to make this right. I want to be a star. You want to be a star? Because I've been in the business for since on and off since the late 80s and more consistently for the past, uh, uh, more consistently. 
now since the early 90s. But uh, um, if you want to be a star, then do what you want to do to try to make it in this town. It's not an easy job. Not an easy job to go through this garbage that I go through every time I, I uh, <clears throat> come on come on the internet or, or uh, have to deal with, with some of these morons. I said, okay, I have a shoot with Christina Applegate. You said, um, guy will do anything. I said, I want to suck your dick. Okay, you said, okay, you were hard before I had. Get the fuck out of here! Everything you just heard this prick say is a fucking lie! Your button off and you say rape you moan dom gong this feels so good dom right parry right you loved it stroking my head crying enjoy not rape just hugs. What are you waiting for? I'm not saying a fucking word to a remark like that. Would you rather marry Gina and eat one filet of fish every day for life? Or die alone and never eat one again? I'd rather die alone and never eat one again. I'll, I'll meet Gina when it's time. Period. I, I am done with fast food garbage. That is garbage. Marry one. Fuck one. Kill Aniston. Gina Corano. A random lady whose cats are dependent upon her to survive. So. Why are you putting Jennifer Aniston and Gina Carano uh, in, in, in the same phrase together? Because there's they're two nice young ladies that I know, yes. But uh, marry one, I, I would marry either one who, who is willing to be my wife. If Jennifer Aniston, who's closer to my age than Gina, would like to be my wife, I'd marry her in a snap. But Jennifer Aniston is sick with COVID. I want her healthy from COVID. Gina, on the other hand, is a uh, she's a health rat, which I'm very honored to have her as a health rat. She's a health rat one um, and a fitness nut too that I love to pieces. But I'm scared that she'll kill me. Ah, well, not not wanting, not not kill, kill, but, but beat me up, kill. You know, she'll kick my ass from here to kingdom come, and uh, without even me wanting my ass whooped, she'll show me a karate move or show me a martial arts move, and bam, put me in the hospital. Oops, I didn't mean to hit you that that hard. Fuck one. Marry one. Kill dog. Scarlett Johansson. Margot Robbie. I'm not going to. I don't like. I don't like what that just says. I, I love them both. I love Scarlett. I love Margot. All right. Fuck one. Uh, fuck one. Marry one. Kill one. I, I, I kill none. Number one. I, I say kill because the, the, that's the way I was raised. OK. Parents always said, I'm going to kill you if you don't do this. So, so it's like something that's stuck in my brain all the time, all right? So forgive me for using the word kill whenever I talk, all right? So I, I don't want to hurt anybody. I mean, even even this this uh, kid that was next to me, I don't even want to hurt him. Nice guy, okay, and I'm honored and thankful to get another snowboard from him, and it's, it's an honor. 
And uh, until we go snowboarding, uh, I don't know what to say. But but uh, with with let's see with with G when is it okay? It's 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 uh, Scarlet and Margot. Mar Scarlet's uh, fighting with her marriage with her husband presently, so I don't know if I could even marry that one. So I would have to marry Margot. I'd have to marry Margot, so I, I'm I'm out of the clear with the uh, all of a sudden I I I I go and take on Scarlet and marry Scarlet like immediately after she's done with the uh, her her dealings with uh, her present husband Colin. Um, I would be scared to uh, all of a sudden get sued by Colin Colin Joe's thinking that uh, she married she. She divorced him to marry me, like real fast. That that that's just the fear I have with with that. So I mean, yes, I do love and care about them both. So, uh, I really don't know what to say to these remarks. Some of them are just way way in the heck out there, and I feel just saddened. Are we done opening up mail or? Perry, so happy in Europe we can start off the weekend right with PCL Live. How about an OOO for the fans? Going to the Oscars? I love you. Uh, you're in Europe right now? I'm not going to Europe, that's for sure, one. Uh, I don't have a passport to go to Europe, two. Uh, going to the Oscars? I'll, I'll turn it on on TV and that's about it. So, how many of the girls from Hooters have you fucked? Every time I go to one, I take one of them whores home. The girls in Costa Mesa are kind of whores. He's got to mention my city, Costa Mesa, where I used to live. No, they're not whores. They're nice young ladies down there, okay? Do not make fun of my 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 do not make fun of my old town Costa Mesa or the girls from Hooters in Costa Mesa. Uh, nothing more sad. Perry, I got an invitation to your Easter brunch on your patio. I'm having four dozen hard-boiled eggs delivered for you to serve to your guests. See you soon. What? Not wanted! Not wanted! If I see them, they're in the trash! Immediately! They don't come in my home! Not wanted! Damn it. Because nobody knows what I want when it comes to getting eggs. I only go for the healthy stuff. It's expensive, I know, but I only go for the healthy stuff. Perry, yeah. love the steam. Mm -hmm. Keep up the good work. Don't let the haters get to you. You rock. Now that is a compliment I am thankful for, honored to get, and really love the person that sent me that one. That is very nice. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Beyond belief. Thank you. That that, that, that makes me happy as I end my stream uh, being a little upset and, and stuff. But that opened my heart up to be very loving and thankful and yes that was a very nice remark thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you see there are good Thumbs people up out there Perry. there are good people in the audience well yeah, there's good people everywhere but you know when when you get uh three hours or six hours of of people just 
bitching you out. You all. haven't had that. You, you can't say that. You haven't had that today. You really haven't. So you can't say that. No, it's it's been it's been good. It's yeah, been good. so it's good. Here's another good guy. Uh, there's a Tom's tips here from your friend Soviet Goat. A little Q and A. Uh, one, two, three, four questions. Question number one, Francis. When your mom. That's not my name. That is not my name. So re say repeat by repeat that by saying my name. Well, I'm going to read it the way it was written, Perry. I know your name is Frank. Your middle name is Frank, but I'm just reading it the way Thank it's you. written. Okay, so don't okay. shoot. The, don't shoot the messenger. I'm just curious why you, you reach down for the water if you're not using it. You have this water transfer thing that goes well, on sometimes. Well, I'm going to wait till you read it. See, I don't want to undo this yet because I'm not done with it yet. Okay, I understand. Uh, question number one. Francis, when your mom stripped you naked, lubed up your butthole, and inserted her used douche tube in your anus, was she proud of or disappointed by the size of your boner. Number one, she didn't rape me. Number two, she wasn't proud of or lube up my penis and, and seek a boner from me because she's not a, uh, uh, a, a, a child molester. And number three, the, the uh, tube just went up with hot coffee going up my ass. It took a while. It took a, a, a couple moments, and then all of a sudden, I sat down on the toilet, and all the poop came out. It was stuffed in my body for about a week. Question number two, Spoonmaster, can you count your teeth for me? How many teeth do you have? Teeth? Yeah. You counting to yourself? Uh huh. My guess is like 50. fourteen on top. Four, so I would think fourteen and fourteen. That that's uh, what is that? Twenty eight. Oh really? Okay, I was gonna guess more than that. Question three. I'm excited to meet you in Pottstown, Pennsylvania. Oh, so Soviet Goat bought a ticket. Wow. Okay. You can't uh, you can't be violent to the man when you meet him. Um, I'll meet him and I'll say hello. I'll probably sign a poster or a picture or whatever he wants. Yeah. That's all. Okay. Uh, I'm excited to meet you in Pottstown, Pennsylvania. Tony Hawk promised me that I can sleep in your hotel room bathtub. Will I have to leave the bathroom when you're taking a shit and masturbating, or can I watch and possibly take a few pictures? Number one, um, this is not a porn event. Doofus. So, uh, and I'm not a porn star. So, uh, the, the, this, these these pornographic remarks are null to the event, null to me, and null to my life. Question four. When you come to Pottstown, PA, can you number one? Bring your tiger. Bring your one tiger. Uh, two, uh, your dew juice filled red condom. And three, the gun you held to Randy's head when you raped him to show us VIP ticket holders exclusively in Pottstown, Pennsylvania on May 13th. Oh, God. I don't own a gun, never will own a gun. Got it? End of story, over and out. I got a squirt gun that holds water in my car. Uh, let me see. 
Um, oh, by the way, uh, Jim had a good idea. If you want to invite Sheila to come with you on the trip. Uh, She's a married woman with a husband that's an attorney. You want to fuck with that? I'm, I'm not interested. Shut up. I'm not interested in her romantically, and neither is anybody else. I was just saying she's not coming because uh, well, she's not. There's nobody doing my hair in uh, some other city other than where I live. Sheila's the only one that does my hair. Well, Sheila's not, the only one that's allowed to touch well, before, my hair. Before you cut me off so rudely, I wasn't going to say it was about your hair. I was going to say she can do fans' hair. She can like you know come to town and like maybe the day before. If you want your hair done, if you want your hair done by Perry's own personal hairdresser, you know she can charge like X amount uh, of money to just get a little uh, trim or you know whatever. I'll have to find out. out if she's available or not. Yeah, I'm saying she can if make she an extra. Wants, she if she wants to do it, she will. If uh, otherwise, she'll probably say no because she's a married woman to an attorney. Do you want to deal with that? You want to get sued by that? And I don't think so. I don't think why, so. Why would the, why would the attorney sue me? Thinking that somebody's going to do something to her? Uh, well, I just told you what the intentions were, that she could do fans' hair. Maybe we can even do your pink dye job live on stage at, uh, if you agree to do that, if we get enough money together. Uh, maybe we could do that on stage at the Uncle Rico show. Not without her touching it. Nobody else is allowed to touch well, my hair. Well, didn't I just say that maybe yeah, we could do it live? Yeah, I know. I know. Okay. Uh, let me see if there's any other things. Okay. This is an easy offer, Perry. Again, we're going to go light on offers today. Uh, so I'm going to mix and match some. Um, fat Chatty Daddy, $20. All you got to do, Perry, is say, Fat Chatty Daddy is the heir to my fortune. That's all you got to say for 20 bucks. But he's not. Well, all you got to do is say it to get $20. I'm afraid if I say it, that'll make something happen. Well, unless there's a lawyer present, I think you're okay. But uh, it's a $20 offer, and all you got to do is say the phrase, Fat Chatty, Fat Daddy Chat. Sorry, let me get this right. Fat Chatty Daddy is the heir to my fortune. I'm not saying it because I'm afraid of what will happen after. I think you're being silly, Perry. I think you take the $20. You know. Fat Chatty Daddy or what the hell you want to no, call this guy? No, don't add to it, Perry. Don't add to it. Just do it the way it is. Fat, ch is that right? How, is, how do you pronounce a person's fat, name? Fat, 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 listen to me. Fat, fat Chatty Daddy. Fat Chatty Daddy. Is the heir to my fortune. What happened? I got an emergency screaming on my phone. Okay. Just turn it off. On both of them. Okay, extreme alert. Uh... Endangered missing. All right, Perry, we're not going to pay attention to that now. Let's get back. Got... This, should, this shouldn't take 10 minutes. Fat Chatty Daddy is in no way the heirs to anything that comes out of my life. Okay, are you glad You're that you got my that? Wife. Are, are, are you glad You're to get that? Not my daughter. Right, Perry, that doesn't nothing. get you. Right, so that doesn't get you $20. So are you saying you don't want to say uh, this? No. Then I don't want to know. I don't want No, I'm not saying it. $20. My daughter, all you got to do is right. say a line. All you got to do is say a line for $20. You don't have to mean it. Just say it. Fat Chatty Daddy is the heirs to my fortune. Not heirs, no. plural. Heirs, singular. And don't add to it. Just do it again, singular, and don't add to it. Fat Chatty Daddy is not the... Perry, do, do we got to sit here all day? Like, you can't just role play with this and say the line to get $20? Fat Chatty Daddy is the heir to my fortune? What fortune? Perry, can you do it again with just, just saying the line? Fat Chatty Daddy is the heir to my fortune? Don't say it like you're asking a question. Say it like a statement. Fat Chatty Daddy is the heir to my fortune. Thank you. Oh, God. But no way is that true. 
Okay, great. And that'll do it for uh, that'll do it for offers, uh, uh, Jim. No more offers today. Thank you. Thank you. We'll save offers for uh, Monday. Thank you. Hey, if there's no Easter patio brunch, why did I get an invitation? Did you get hacked? The hard-boiled egg delivery was expensive. Can PCL pay me back? I didn't say anything about you sending anything over here. Uh, I don't have eggs here from you, so I'm not paying you back. And who's this? Who's this a picture of? Sorry, I was loading a picture. And hold on a second. Uh, I'll get to that in a second. So, what were you saying, Perry? Yeah, yeah. I don't have a uh, bunch of eggs here. I don't want you. Se- I want nobody sending me eggs anymore. I have a specific brand or type of egg I prefer eating. Okay, because of my health issue. They're organic eggs, and that's it. What brand is that, Perry? Is that the Costco's brand? Sometimes Costco, sometimes Eggland. Most of the time, it's Eggland's best. Those are very good. They're expensive, though. Yes. Right? Eggs are going up. Every that's price. right. Eggs are going up in price. Yes, I know. So I'll get a dozen eggs for either two weeks or a whole complete month. Because when I run out of the eggs, then I stick with the oatmeal. And I have oatmeal for breakfast for the next week or two weeks. Okay. And then go back to eggs. Yeah. Uh, the picture I was showing you, Perry, this is from uh, Bob Levy. And he wanted you to uh, see his uh, – he's in his jacuzzi right now relaxing. He said you're going to uh, join him in there when you come to town, maybe that Friday before the show. There he is relaxing. He said it's hey, just – just enough room to fit two people. So you guys will be nice and snug in there. I don't like that remark. It's really a single person jacuzzi, but he said he could he could fit you in. So bring your bathing suit when you come out. Yeah, that'll happen. So that looks comfy. <clears throat> You're not gonna squeeze. You're not gonna squeeze me into a bathtub. That's for sure. <clears throat> and I'm not rubbing against another guy at all. If we got Scarlet in the in the in the uh, two person jacuzzi, I'll be in there with her. If we got She Hulk, I'll be in there with her. If we got Gina, I'll be in there with her right, or Margot. But, Bob, but it's Bob's. It's Bob's jacuzzi. He's obviously gonna be in there, so it's his jacuzzi. That's at his house. And again, he doesn't he have a wife and, and children? Uh, pff, what are they going to think? Uh, they're going to think he's relaxing in his uh, hot tub like you know, ordinary people do. Perry, it's Phil Collins. I can't sing or play drums anymore. So I've been spending a lot of time watching your stream. Keep up the good work. Big fan. What happened? Why are you unable to sing and unable to play the drums anymore? Because, dude, you were awesome for all the years I've I've uh, been into your music. From the late 70s through the 80s and 90s and early 2000s. You've been awesome. Been awesome. Um, what happened? Are you, are you, are, is your health okay? Are you okay? And if uh, you, you can get better and get back on the sticks and you get back on the drums... Um, I kind of, you know, nickname drums sticks because you're pl- playing the drumsticks. Uh, if you're able to get back on the drums, uh, I would be honored to uh, come watch uh, you and your band, your your uh, either Phil Collins band or the band Genesis, get back together and do a gig again. It'd be an honor. This is a test. This is only a test of the Perry Caravello emergency broadcast system. 666, 666, 666, 666, 666, 666, 666, 666, 666, 666, 666, 666, 666, 666, 666, 666. Did 
disgusting. All right, Perry. Yeah, uh, in normal uh, normal stream, we would have opened more mail, but uh, in order to qualify as a uh, mailbag stream, we technically have to have a certain quota. So, can you open another mailbag, please, so we can technically call this Mailbag Friday? Looky here. Surprise, surprise, surprise. Oh, just what you need. Note. Mr. Caravello, we we hear we here, Snickers is your favorite candy, one of. Please try please try these custom Snickers Easter eggs on your stream. You should eat at least eight. What? But also unwrap some and, and hide them around your apartment. No freaking way am I unwrapping them and hiding them. I'm not letting chocolate melt all over the place in my home. Lovingly from Snickers. No, it's not going to happen. Not going to happen. I'll show, I'll show the box, and I'll show a Snickers egg, but I'm not eating right now, and I'm not hiding eggs in my home. Okay, here's the candy wrapper. This is a Snickers egg. We'll set this box right here for now. It'll go somewhere else in a little in a little bit. Ah, junk food. I don't need junk food in my house. And they're opening up the the package of uh, Snickers and holding it up. It's a, like a half an egg. You might be able to see. Crack that, crack that in half. Like, what is this? Like, a, I, I'm not a chocolate guy. So, is that like a candy promote, like an Easter promotion? Yeah, it's it's promotion. A, it's a, it's like an Easter promotion. What's it's, inside? It's is, got is the Snickers normal, though, is Snickers the normal, the normal, the, the normal Snickers, Snickers with with inside? the nuts. Uh, yeah, with with nuts and, and the caramel and the and the uh, the, the. Try it. Try it. Typical Snickers. All right. That's nice. That's okay, you can grab another mailbag. Uh, by the way, anybody joining late that wants to get tickets to see Perry live on the Uncle Rico show, live in Pottstown, there's actually an easier link you can use. Just go to Shuli, uh, the Shuli Network dot com. Make sure you type in the the Shuli Network dot com. It'll uh, direct you right to the uh, tickets. Get those VIP tickets because uh, those are going to sell out. Uh, I don't know. With the VIP ticket, you get to meet Perry. All of us will be there. Myself, Garrett, Jim, Tony Hawk. So you want to get those tickets today. A lot of people already saying they bought tickets, Perry, from PCL. Isn't that nice? Very nice. Very nice. Okay, let's... And if you don't know what I'm talking about, it's the Uncle Rico Show Live with live stand-up featuring Bob Levy, Shuli, Mike Morse with special guests. Anthony Cumia, Casey Armstrong, Mike Buschetti, Vince the Attorney, Cardiff Electric, Tony Hawk, and look at that in big, bold, colorful writing, Perry Caravello. And that's Saturday, May 13th in Pottstown, PA at Soul Jules. Check for a note, please. Nothing. Wait, something. I don't need... I don't need... I don't want, nor do I need, another jar of fucking Skippy peanut butter. Do not send me any more jars of peanut butter. It's going in the fucking garbage. Can I you see it, it first? Before you slam it in the garbage like a child, can I see it, please? And can you also read the note? Bitch. Thank you.
Mr. Caravello, since you are darting, bopping, and taking uh, sneaky peas, we require you to write the words dead air chair, C-H-A-I-R, on the, on the back of your streaming chair. These are washable, and you may use your favorite color from, from Twitch Incorporated. Oh, my God. Wait, wait, is that even the right thing? That sounds like that's markers. The one you just opened over there. That's not for the peanut butter. This. Yeah, it is. It's yeah, liquid, that's, okay. liquid I, chalk markers. I think that's a good idea to write dead air chair when you dart away. Hopefully it'll be less sad. Is Was there a note that came with the peanut butter? There was, right? Is that everything, that, that was all it said for the peanut butter and this. But were they in the same box together? Yes. Okay. Okay, sorry. Okay, I understand now. Um, I don't. I wouldn't yell at people for uh, sending you a nice gift, but okay. Let's see I, I what kind of color. Let's see what color I don't options like, we have. On this. I don't like. I don't like doing stuff that is just offensive to me. But you like peanut butter. Because right? that's I, offensive to me. See, I personally hate peanut butter, but you like it. Been eating it my entire life. That's right. Didn't they call you the peanut but butter I've, kid I've advanced, at one point? I've advanced from peanut butter because the peanut butter nut is getting heavy on me to almond butter, which is a lot lighter of a butter. Okay, I've never tried that. So um, what? I got to write. Dead air chair. Let's get a good bold color. I think red works. Let's let's do let's do red. Red or green? Let's do red. Uh, you know, red. green can look all right too. Let me see. Let me see all the color options. Green, I like. What else? I'm just gonna show you what's in here. Purple, I see. I see orange. All right, let's do um, let's do green. I think green will look nice. So, so just uh, turn the chair around, and on the back of the chair, in bold letters, you're gonna write "dead air chair," like one after the other, like dead, and then underneath that air, and underneath that chair shake it up a little bit you might want to use that a lot one. test it out on paper first do you know that you're nominated for the dead air awards this year that's a big deal whoa you you're nominated for the dead air awards it's like streamers that leave their stream and just have completely a dead air. You're apparently like nominated in like 12 categories. So remember, big letters, dead air chair. Dead and then underneath that air, underneath that chair. Big so the camera can see it. Oh, shit. Let me write on paper first. I thought that's what you were doing. Why don't you write it on the uh, tiger painting? Just sign your name to it a little bit. The tiger frame. Kiss my motherfucking ass! I'm not going to do that. Stupid son of a fucking bitch. There you go calling me names again. That's the last fucking time you're going to see that goddamn picture on that screen. I doubt that. And, and I'm, this fucking thing doesn't write. These fucking markers don't write. Well, they, they clearly do. You just got to figure it out. Is there a way to like, is there something you got to puncture to get it to work or something? No, you don't puncture this. Okay, I don't know. I'm not Water there. Water base, easy, clean, non-toxic. Okay, shake, press, write. Oh, okay, I got to press it hard. <laughs> yeah. Why don't you try, try it on the wall? Go fuck yourself. Damn it. All right. Do you got it out now? No. All right. If you can't get this going, let's just finish up. You could do it on a Monday. Yeah. Thank you. No, no. no. That means you could still try to get it out, Perry. It doesn't mean give up I this am, second. I'm, I'm fucking fed up. No, I'm not. There's a, yeah, you, try. you can at least make God, an attempt. I'm all this and shit! What are you doing? Where Just... is all this shit coming from? I don't even know where it's... I, I, I don't see this 
God damn it! Perry, eye on the prize. All you're doing is trying to get this ink out. This non-toxic water base. Are you going for a pee? Are you really going to go for a pee? Oh my God. Look at this. The dead air chair right there. Two peas on the stream is way better than one every 30 fucking minutes. It is. Shit about only two peas on this stream. It's not, okay, it's not that I'm giving you S about going for a pee. I understand, you know, nature calls time to time. It's the, it's the manner in which you do it. And it always seems to come about when you're frustrated or angry about something that you, you almost do it like, I'm going to go pee as like an F you to me in the audience. That, that's my issue with it. I don't want to be like that, no. Well, that's how it is most of the time. That's my issue with the defiant P. It, you know, the sneaky P is annoying too, but it's just that. And and somebody somebody's asking for music. No, I don't play music uh, on Fridays because it stays up on YouTube and we get murdered by uh, copyright. We already get murdered as it is with Perry's foul language that immediately demonetize everything uh, anyway. That's why that's why PCL makes no money off uh, YouTube uh, between copyright and Perry's potty mouth. So. Uh, my body mouth, please. Yeah, I know you can't help yourself, but that's why I can't play music. I, I could play Ricky Horney, but that would get old. Hey, hey, don't come back here without the marker. Dude, just get the marker. The marker doesn't even work. Jab it down. I got. I got. It does I got to sit here for, for quite Harry, some time. No, what you got to do is listen. You just got to jab it down. I've seen markers like this. You just kind of jab it down to get the guy. Like the whole point of the marker pushes down on the paper to get it out. I know. It's one of those. Yeah. And it's... It'll come out. I mean, you wasted this much time doing it. It would be weird to come back and not even have that ready. There, there, there. You got it. Okay. So, let's go. They did lose... They did loosen the, uh, the rules on cursing a little bit, but Perry says them so much... You know, and they're not they're not friendly with the C word either, so Okay, so what am I writing on back the, of the chair the back again? Of the chair. Dead air chair. So dead in big letters and underneath that air and then chair underneath that. So yeah, uh, YouTube did uh, loosen restrictions a little bit. But in order for us to get anything from it, they'd have to loosen them a lot more. Air. And then underneath chair. And underneath that, why don't you just do hashtag PCL for life in smaller print? So, yeah, that's why it's important to support us on Patreon. Because that's where the Monday streams go to. And there's also all, all other stuff like phone calls and voicemails. Uh, because there's no revenue generated from uh, YouTube whatsoever. Uh, from PCL. Can I see it? Can I see how it looks? That's pretty good. Where's the hashtag? I gotta, I gotta go tic-tac-toe. Sign. No, nah, never mind. You, Over you here? No, nah, 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 forget it. There's no room for it now. All right, forget oh. it. Let's just come back. Oh, crap. Raining out there. Thank you. We could do rain, 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 rain. Tune in later for Perry's uh, weather report stream. But right now we're going to finish this stream. Please sit oh, down, right. Perry. Perry, please sit down. I'm asking you really nice. Can you sit down and you keep doing this stuff? You are doing a live stream. Thank you. Let me see if there's anything else from me that I got to mention before we move on. All right, yeah, there is a couple of Tom's tips here. Let me, let me get this out of the way. Uh, here is a tip, Tom's tip from Matt C. Perry, did you get the truck yet? No. You got the keys. No, already. I have no vehicle. Where is the vehicle? You got the keys already. I got I'm, the keys. That doesn't mean I know where the vehicle is. I'm still paying for the parking spot. Where? And, and Amy. Where? And Amy keeps trying to find it. 
do you care about your don't you care about your fans where the fuck is the goddamn truck huh why haven't you gotten the truck yet if you're not gonna tell me where the fucking truck is the keys go in the trash oh that sounds like a smart that'll show him uh We'll move on. This uh, next one is from another Tom's tip. Remember, all Tom's tips benefit Jim and Garrett. And uh, I, I want to get uh, Jim to uh, Pottstown. So uh, Tom's tips are uh, much appreciated. Uh, this is from our friend Wangler. And I'll wait for you to be done chugging that water. Hey, Perry, it's Wangler. Got my VIP tickets to see you in Pottstown, PA on May 13th. Gonna be in the room next to yours in the hotel. Gonna be with you at the pool. Gonna be with you at the free continental breakfast. Gonna be following you around the whole day and possibly back to your apartment located at 77. Actually, no, no, don't. Get the fire, you keep, you keep saying my goddamn address, I'm gonna fucking fucking fuck. I'm gonna fucking fire you. I'm gonna fucking show you. I'm gonna fucking screw you. You can get my fucking ass. And no, I won't go back to fucking PA. Uh, no, you can't say his address, uh, Wangler. I was actually going to cut him off before you... Fuck you going down that fucking road, you piece of shit! Are you talking to me? Him! Okay. And please don't threaten to cancel your appearance uh, on uh, May 13th. Uh, that's unprofessional. We can't do that. You already signed a contract. Um, okay. Thank you, Wangler. Fucking start beating Kenny, this shit. Love the show. That interview with Scarlett Johansson was amazing. You're a natural, my friend. KCL for life. This is not KCL. That's my oldest brother, the piece of dog shit that has robbed a fucking family. Both of them. <clears throat> Perry, you are awesome. You have great style. You should find the love of a good woman or dude. You deserve to be happy but lower your standards. You women only. Women only. That's nice. Thank you. If you open your heart to the liberation of darkness, you might find love. Join Satan. Find a satanic slut to fuck Never. the stupid out of you. 666-LLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLL
Perry, Frank, F-R-A-N-K, Caravello, Francis. I know of a Francis Ford Coppola, and that's the only Francis I know of. Hello, my friend. My lover Randy Hani Kalahani says hello too. We are big fans of your scams. I have a lot to learn from you, my friend. What's your job? Stop lying about your stupid garbage. This is my job, streaming. Cripe. Hello, my friend. My greatest dream is to scam the scam master. Your fake car crash, snowboarding, your girlfriend, all fake classic scams. Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay. Oh God Almighty, get out of here! How can I get out of here? Francis. $100 to drag the credins around town with your Kia. SHUT THE FUCK UP! Get these morons off my stream. You don't drag a beautiful piece of furniture. Pure wood. Jag off. That's why they're jerking me around with my 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 late mom's beautiful dresser because it's a beautiful piece of furniture. Not that piece of uh, press garbage that they sell all all over the place these days. Thank you for subscribing. Perry, we all love and appreciate you. This is a highlight of my week. Please keep that in mind when you start screaming at us in 60 meters. In 60 meters? What do you mean? 60 minutes, meaning that that was okay, earlier. Okay. And the person knew that you would start screaming at everybody, which you did, of course. But that was very nice. Okay, well, well I'm, I'm sorry for yelling at everybody. I, I, I don't mean to yell at everybody, okay? There's, there's a lot of nice people out there, and you're one of them, and I thank you for it. Uh, but you know, I, I get I get pushed overboard too much, and uh, right. But you're in control. You're in control of how you react to things. That that think that's the point. And anyway, that was a nice that was a nice remark, saying just like we all love and appreciate you, which is true. There's nobody tuning in here uh, that doesn't. You know, even if people hate your guts, they still love to watch you. So uh, that's that's I think that I think that's the point to take away, right? Yeah. Thank you. Almost a thousand people watching right now on a Friday afternoon, so that's nice. Um, let's see if there's anything else from me. Mm. No, there isn't. Goes from the bottom of my neck all the way up to the top of my right eyeball. Oh, that hurts. Is it weather related? Probably. Like, is it raining out or something like that, or is it? Yeah, I don't know. You, did, you did say what? Didn't you say earlier it was raining? Yeah, it is raining. Yeah, it's going to be raining for the next few days. On and off. It's not raining right now, but it's on. Hang on, let me see. It's it's on and off. No, no, rain. no, no, no. I don't want a whole weather report. I was just making. Yeah, sense. you're not going to get a whole weather report, but it's it's on and off rain. Yeah, yeah. It's raining. It's raining northwest of us. But it's not raining right here. Okay, you want to give the five day, or can we move on? We can move on. My husband and I are moving to your area soon. Can we get an invite to your pool party? I'll show you my boobs. They are big. Hail Satan. There is no swimming pool to have a pool party. They're rebuilding the damn thing. So, eh, no such thing of a freaking party. And there's, there's no parties in my home. It's too small for a party here. I don't do those things in my home. I do them at facilities that are able to hold parties. Like, of course, my favorite restaurant, the Rainbow Bar and Grill. And the clubs next to them, uh, Dave Gazzari's, is, uh, Gazzari's nightclub, which they turned into 
Billboard Live, and I don't I don't remember what they call it today. So Gazaris, as well as the the um, uh, the Roxy, okay, the, the Key Club. Gazaris turned their name into the Key Club, <clears throat> and then then you got the the Rainbow Bar and Grill, of course, my favorite restaurant. And then uh, next to there is um, oh shit! I even forgot the name of that club now. Holy smokes! I'm getting dumber than shit. Uh, uh, you got it. Get me out of the weed. Thank you for subscribing. Hi, Perry. Quick question. If I said that I never feed Perry McDonald's, but then you catch me sending McDonald's to your house, what would that make me? A liar? Thank you for subscribing. Thanks for the cheers, Godzu. Perry, I missed the end of the stream on Monday. What time did Gina show up? Uh, I'm going to laugh at that because <laughs> she never did show up. Scamming again. More scamming. Scam, 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 scam. Let's scam Perry. Let's treat him like shit for six hours or eight hours or whatever. How many hours you're going to freaking abuse me? No, 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 and no. And then no. scam me. One doesn't have anything to do with the other. That was for people mm. that didn't catch Monday. Uh, you were talking to, oh, you're always talking to various Gina accounts. You're still doing it to this second, like as of this morning. I'm not, well, yeah, I'm on line. I don't know who yeah, I'm I talking know. to. Yeah, I know. You, I'm talking about your Instagram addiction. In fact, it's one of the things I was talking to. Uh, Chrissy Mars producer, uh, when you go on there on Sunday, maybe they can have, you know, because Chrissy does a show with a panel of, uh, you know, attractive women. Maybe they can get through to you about your Instagram addiction and your addiction to talking to fake female celebrities. But anyway, uh, you were talking to an account that was, what was it? Gina Carano 000, right? Yeah. You're not talking to that oh, one I, anymore, are you? I'm. I know, know it's hard to keep track because you are talking to so many uh, fake Gina's. But uh, you said if Gina came over that night, which I guess you and the fake Gina said that she was going to come over tonight, uh, that you would agree that that was fake and you should take a break from Instagram. And she didn't come over, but you haven't taken a break, have you? No comment. No comment. Yeah. All right. Uh, anyway, uh, I, I do want to talk to you about this. I don't want to do this right now because it's going to take too much time. But I did notice you were talking to, uh, and this is thanks thanks to the uh, Instagram scam squad that alerted me to this. You were talking to a fake Scarlet account, and this was a legit yeah. scammer. Well, I mean, you're talking to so many. It, it's like yeah, you know, I, I don't know who's who anymore. Right, but you still engage with them and you still talk to them nonstop without questioning anything. Uh, and this one... Well, until she shows up at my front door, uh, who the fuck do I know who am I talking to? Right. I think this one was Scarlet, Scarlet Dash Cuteness was the one you were talking to. I believe. I don't anyway, know that I don't is. have it in front of me. It, it, uh, maybe I'll, I'll, no. I'll, I'll put this on Patreon or something like that because I, I don't have the room to get into it here. But uh, you were talking... Because there's two kinds of fake uh, female celebrities that you talk to on Instagram. One are just fans that know that it's an easy thing to get you to talk to them. Uh, and then the second are legitimate scammers, like people that have these scam like photo accounts that are just looking for marks like you to like give away information. Anyway, I, this, the Instagram scam squad sent me this thing where you were talking to this person. I don't think, I think it was the other day. And again, I took the week off from talking to Perry after Monday. I was kind of burnt out uh, on anything uh, PCL. So... What are you doing, Perry? Why, why did you have to grab that box right in the middle of talking? Well, uh, why, back. Did you, why did you just do that? I, I don't know why I picked it up. I don't know. Okay, because you don't, don't want to listen to the truth. Because you don't want to listen to the truth. 
No, it's, I'm listening. I'm listening as I'm doing you, picking you, that you up. Actively listening. look for distractions whenever the truth comes into conversation. Anyway, uh, my point is, uh, so this scammer that you were talking to was clearly a scammer, broken English, the whole nine, and it was back and forth. And you're like, "Can I see you? Can I see you?" The whole thing. And then this person said, uh, "Can you please uh, log on to my fan page?" Which always is a, a road to at lead to money. And you were saying only if you show up here, and then. You actually said the line, and this is a back and forth in a DM on Instagram for anybody who's wondering. Uh, Perry's at Instagram where he's talking to this fake scammer pretending to be Scarlett Johansson. And the scammer says, can you join my fan club? And, you know, it's just a, it's a small fee to start. I think it was only like $10, which is not normal. And Hell you no, said, I'm not, I'm not. what you said is, my boss, Tom Brennan, is not going to like this. And then... The scammer replied, don't tell your boss about me. Do well, then that right there, that means you're bullshit. Right. But do you remember this conversation that I'm talking about? I, I, I vaguely oh, recall. Well, it was only a couple of days ago. Anyway, so the scammer Still. as Scarlet goes, uh, don't tell your boss. And then Perry responds, well, he's not going to like it when if you're asking me for money. And he's like, it's just a little fee for the fan club. And don't please don't. Shit. And it was a back Bullshit. and forth. Well, hold on a second, Perry. It was a back and forth, back and forth. And then uh, Perry responds, "All right, keep it between you and me. And hopefully, you're the real Scarlet, and you will show up on my stream." <laughs> you know. So anyway, you can more see what lies. I'm, you can see what I'm dealing with here. More lies. I'll get into that in greater detail on like a phone call or something. Uh, so okay, uh, we'll move on. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for subscribing. Hi, baby girl. That sweater? And I thought I was gay. Is that or I want to blow guy's sweater, sweetie? You're definitely gay. Should I drive up to PA in May? Stay away. Stay away. Perry is way VG big fan. You're going to Pottstown, PA, but you won't come to Cincinnati? You have a huge fan base here. Come visit Cincinnati. I. Hard. I'm you. not being forced to go to Cincinnati. I am not allowing Cincinnati's disgusting filet of fish from McDonald's, another disgusting facility, to be a part of my trip anywhere. And if I see filet of fish... In my room, in the in the PA, I'm gonna demand a trip home immediately. Demand it because I, I I am fed up with the crap here at my house. When the restaurant down the street it has still been uh, on the rebuild, so I don't know where the fuck they're they're getting McDonald's from, either in Encino or in Northridge. Uh, is the two closest McDonald's I could think of that would be brought, bringing McDonald's here. Or the McDonald's next to the Birmingham High. I'm going to Cincinnati to visit the spot where you murdered Dimebag Daryl. Do not ever bring up that situation. I have nothing to do with the death of that man. And no, don't ever say that I did that. Don't ever go there. I am friends with their with Diamond uh Vinnie Paul's sister. I don't talk to her that much anymore. Stormy, um that, 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 that's just that's just abuse. That's just freaking abuse saying that I murdered Dime Bag. You bastards. One of my favorite bands, Pantera. All right, Perry, I got a, one last Tom's tip here. Uh, this one is from Satan Caravello. Hey, Franny, it's me, Satan, Satan Caravello. 
I would love to go to the show and be there front and center. I'm sure they're refer referring to the live Uncle Rico on May 13th. However, I have a few concerns. Number one, is there any guarantee that you will be ready to perform? Your stream on Monday almost had me unsubscribing and you've been bopping and darting around and being so distracted lately that uh, your stream can be a labor and a bore to watch. So I guess th there's definitely some valid concerns there. You do do a lot of bopping and darting. You did that a lot on Monday. This person wants to know, Satan Caravella wants to know, uh, are you going to be ready to perform when you go to the live show on the 13th of May? We'll, we'll, we'll see what happens. That doesn't instill me with confidence. If if I got to deal with somebody that, say, if I have to deal with the devil, Satan the devil being there? No, it's not, no, it's no, not no. quote unquote Satan the devil. It's uh, just the fact that it's a concern where are you going to be able to... Like, if you see a stack of napkins on the table, are you going to, like, grab them and, like, run out of the, the hall or something like that? Like, like you're very easily... You're not in my home. In my home, I'm doing certain stuff in my home specifically for my purposes in my home. Okay. He goes on. Number two, will I be safe from your raging, unstable menta mentality? Stay away from me. So the answer, they're not safe. Stay away from me. Okay. You've been attacking more people you lately. Mess with me physically? You mess with me uh, mentally? I don't know what I'll do. <laughs> no one's messing with you physically, Perry. You're the one that attacks people physically. Uh, you've been attacking more and more people lately, and you portray an image of an unhinged madman. Number three, will the men in the audience be safe from your unwanted sexual harassment? I have been hearing a lot about your groping a young man named Corey under a blanket at your apartment while watching an adult film. That's a fucking lie! That's a motherfucking lie! God damn it, that's a fucking lie! Number four. Will you be bringing your Credenza Diplomas Tiger Prince to the show for auction? Nothing is getting me off of my home! No pictures! No furniture! Stop it! Stop it! Get me off this goddamn stream! Stop it right the fuck now! Stop it! Okay, he goes on We're to done. say... He goes on to say, I have a lot of money, love for Franny, and your satanic stream. And lastly, will you make a pit stop in Cincinnati for a filet of fish, chili bath, and or visit to the after school? On your way no, to Pottstown. No way possible am I stopping in Cincinnati. Uh, uh, it's one way trip to PA. And then one way trip back home. Uh, I'm not interested in going to Cincinnati, Ohio. Get me the now fuck Now you haven't home. been on it. Okay. Hey, Perry. Enough with the enough with the language. I mean, ha, ha, come on. This is, this is, I'm tired of this garbage. I, I know. Perry. Tired of these Why are you? I am tired. I am tired. I am sick of it. Why are you picking up the markers again? Like, like, what's the thing? I there? don't know why I'm this crap. Because I want to shut this damn box. You, have you been diagnosed with like a real like bad obsessive compulsion? Like, why are you doing that right now? You're on the stream. This because is a box. I'm not closing. Right, but God. You, you, what well, you can do this when you're not streaming. This is not entertaining for your audience. I'm and not. It, and it also distracts you. It also distracts you. Yeah, I know it distracts me. So why don't you put it down and keep it down? It's distracting. Right. Okay. Uh, you haven't been on an airplane in a while. Uh, are you an aisle seat, middle seat, or window seat kind of guy? Window. Window seat. Window over the wing. See, I would imagine that you'd be an aisle seat guy because it's a pain in the butt if somebody... Like, let's say you're sitting next to Garrett, which you probably will be. You're sitting in the seat with Garrett. Or, <laughs> I mean, I, I can imagine Garrett will maybe be in the window, you being on the aisle, and poor soul being in the middle. But uh, if you have to go... I'm imagining you're going to have to dart up and down to the bathroom on the plane every now and then. It's not fair to the person sitting in the aisle for the guy in the window seat to keep, you know annoying people so and usually, then i do the aisle i mean i've been i've been in in all three seats 
I've been in the aisle seat, I've been the guy in the middle, and I've been the guy at the window. Right. So I'm just saying, for somebody with your uh, bathroom habits, I would imagine, I would have to say, just out of aisle. courtesy courtesy to other people, you'd be an aisle person. Yeah, the aisle. Yeah. I think that would be, I think that would be the way to go. But, uh, just, yeah. Uh, okay. Let me see if there's any more. No, that's it. We're all caught up. Okay. Good. Plus. It's Emily Sears. I'm offended that Tomb said I was 55. I'm a hot 20 year old model, just like Perry remembers in 1988. Apologize to me, Tomb. See? What what are you saying C to? Like what what C I told you I'm glad Emily came on the stream to uh get in your face. Thank you, Emily. Thank you. Get into that get into my boss's face, the pain in the ass. Uh so for people that don't know what we're talking about, Perry and I had a long can you stop doing whatever you're doing? Perry and I had a long conversation about this uh last weekend. It's on Patreon if you want to hear it. There's a whole story. Uh but I, he's I trying know. to say Emily Sears is fake. He's trying to say that well, she's no, a no, 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 no. Because, because I, I don't know what to say here. Uh, she was a young kid when I knew her when I lived out there. Right. I, she wasn't. In, she wasn't a teenager yet. Uh, I mean, she might. Have been, you might have. Were you in junior high? Were you in elementary or junior high when I knew you? It's not a one-way conversation. They can't immediately anyway, answer you. Yeah, anyway. I don't know. She was a real young girl. She was a real cute young girl when I knew her. Okay. Right. She knew I, my, I, was just, my, I was just doing some basic math, right? So if you knew, if she was a young, we kind of agree. I'm just going to skim through this. You and I agree that she was fit. Now, apparently there is an actual model named Emily Sears that I was not yes. aware of at the time we talked. But now that I'm, I'm aware that there is a model coming. But that's, you're confusing that with somebody that you knew in your school days. No, I'm not confusing that at all because it's the same girl. Okay, well, if it's the same girl, then she would be in her late 50s, Perry, because... No, she wouldn't. Okay, if you... Absolutely not. Perry, we've already established that she was 15 or so in 19... Stop. I know you got your mouth open and you want to talk, but I'm going to talk. We've already established that she was 15 years old in 1985, right? So how is she... What did she just you say she was? was she was she said she was she just said she was a hot twenty year old. So she just doesn't age? So that was nineteen you knew her in the eighties. How could she be a hot twenty year old now? She would be in her late fifties if you knew her back in the quote unquote day. She wasn't she was she was still in I think high school junior high. It doesn't high school matter. Even if she was born in nineteen eighty five, she'd still be older than twenty. Even if she was born of in nineteen eighty five. Of course. If she was an she's infant messing, in nineteen eighty five. She's messing with you as well. She's, She's messing with you as well. All right, guys, listen. I don't have time to get God into this. God Almighty! All right, all right you, Perry, you're so frustrating, man. I, I, we had this conversation. Let's finish this, please. Okay, listen. I'm not taking this shit anymore today. Uh, Perry, I don't want. I don't care. I don't care what you think you're taking or whatever. But, yeah, maybe Gypsy just cryogenic. Maybe she froze herself in time. But it, you're so anyway. But my point was in diffusing this was because. Uh, last Saturday night on Instagram, Perry got on a video chat with some girl pretending to be this Emily Sears or Sears that he some how allegedly knew. And who else was on the call, Perry, off camera? Whit Whitney Houston's widow. <laughs> Widower, uh, Bobby Brown, which I talked to you and, and explained that that was fake and we debunked it. But now, yeah, anyway, guys, you see what I'm dealing with. If you want to hear the whole call, it's about 40 minutes. It's on our Patreon. Patreon.com slash Perry Caravolo. Sign up today. I really appreciate it. We don't make any money on YouTube, so that's a great way to support uh, Perry as well as oh, myself boy. and uh, the exhausting things that I have to go through. Uh, yeah, and there'll be, yeah. More of, there'll be more phone calls up this week. And I just couldn't do any Perry stuff this week. I, I had to take a break. I was really burnt out after Monday. Uh, anyway. Thank you for subscribing. But... Nice sweater. Hey. That is if you're going for a gay choir teacher look. Can we have one stream where you don't brag about 1992?
has to I don't even like talking about it! You fucking asshole! Yo, Perry, it's Snoop. Me and Martha Stewart are watching the stream and baking. Well, Martha's doing the baking. I'm just getting baked, ha ha. Peace, bro. Dude, when are you gonna put that pipe down? When are you gonna when, when, when are you gonna do things without having to get stoned? All right. Because hmm. drugs, marijuana doesn't do anything good for you. Cocaine or crack or any of that other street garbage doesn't do anything good for you. I'm on too much medica medicine for my for my other issues. My other health issues, so there's no way I'm going to touch that street crap ever again. <sighs> Thank you for subscribing. Perry, it's Wavy G. Big fan. I'm boycotting the stream till you come to Cincinnati. I'll still watch no. it, but I will sit in silent protest in a child's Bo pose. Bo boycott it all you freaking want to. I'm not coming to Cincinnati. Not allowed. Oh, you're giving me a freaking headache. This sucks. <sighs> Good morning, my little pinky penis. Stop telling lies about me, honey. We both know what happened. Don't make me come over and spank you with my jumbo rod. Nothing to say to this motherfucker. Nothing. No, I. Uh, please. <laughs> pinky? That's exactly what you are, is a pinky. You fucking pinky. Disgusting, demoralizing, sick. And I'm, and I'm... I just talked to she Hulk and she will be at the Uncle Rico show. Also, you look like my grandma but with an Italian cowboy hat on and I love it. I don't think so. But she Hulk will be at the Uncle Rico show, good. But if Scarlet's not there, then I take the she Hulk home. Thank you for subscribing. Ordered my VIP tickets. $40 to meet Perry Caravello and Anthony Cumia. Hell yeah. Can't wait. Love you, Perry. Very nice. I got tons of weed for us to smoke. That is, that's never going to freaking happen. No, 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 no. Stop it. You'll meet me and you'll meet Anthony Cumia, but if you try to get me to smoke weed, out of the question. I, I'm I'm sick enough as it is with my other problems. You don't want I don't want to be put in the hospital doing that garbage. Hey, it's Francis. Everyone, please come to my apartment on May 13th, 2023. Please come take care of 102 in my absence. I will left the pizza in the fridge. You're not allowed here when I'm gone. Do doors, all doors will be locked. No one's allowed here except for the management when I am gone. Yeah. The, 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 see, now, 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 now you better cancel it because I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. Cancel it. Because of that remark right the fuck there, I, I'm not leaving town. Hey, Perry, I've told you, uh, you've made a commitment now. You're, you're going to go. You don't threaten to can. See, it's one thing when you threaten to cancel your stream every two seconds. We're all used to that. But when people are buying tickets to see you live. I've got fucking assholes wanting to break into my home and steal my stuff. Okay. Out of the fucking question. Perry, you leave the home all the time. When you close the door, there's no problems, right? You got locks. It's, it's going to be no yeah, problem. Yeah, well, that's for a couple of hours or, not, or a couple of moments. Yeah, Perry, not for a few days. You're going to be fine. Listen to me. You'll be fine. When you have a commitment to do a live show, which you have, if you're tuning in late, Perry's going to be doing a live show in Potsdam, PA on May 13th. Uh, we'll plug it at the end of the stream. 
but uh, you've agreed to be there. There are people now, our fans, our, our viewers, our subscribers, our followers, they're buying tickets to be, to be there. They're gonna be committing to travel plans, like buying plane tickets, uh, you know, hotels, things like this. You can't say every two seconds that you're canceling. I'm gonna have to hire somebody to stay here then. Okay, maybe we'll do that. Not we, not we, I. Family member. No, I don't think so, Perry. That's not gonna happen. Uh, who the fuck are you? You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. I do. For people that are late to today's stream, Perry requests you send him dog food today. Lots of dog food. Keep no! the dog food coming. Dog food, please. Trash! 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 All fucking dog food goes in the fucking trash! You assholes! You evil, sick bastards! I'm freaking done! Thank it's Wavy G. Big fan. Several of us PCL fans in Cincinnati are gathering outside Mayor McKee's Gunny's office to organize a peaceful protest. O-H-I-O. -O. What? Excuse me. Ugh. This sucks. But why? What, what? Protest for what? I'm not going to Cincinnati. <laughs> You're not offering to pay me the amount of money I want. I'm not going. Next. Thank you for subscribing. This is Scarlett's assistant. She thinks you're in love with May. Think we would get along great 7722 Reseda Boulevard. Next. God damn it, give me the next fucking piece of shit you want to put on my stream. Don't talk to me like that, Perry. That's not nice. No, I just fucking did. I'm shutting the goddamn computer off. No, you're not, Perry. No, you're not. Fucking bullshit. What did we talk about? What did we talk about earlier? What did we talk about earlier? Your behavior. I told you I'd work with you if you stopped acting like an animal. You're Look at Scarlet. Working. Look at Scarlet. Get Scarlet's picture. Look at Scarlet. Look at Scarlet. Yeah. Hey, get the picture in your hand. No, get it in your hand. Pick it up. Look at it. It's time to calm down. Look at Scarlet. Is it working? No, no. Don't throw no. it down. Don't don't throw it down. Look at it. Stare into it. Stare into it. Yeah, I'm sorry. Apologize to her. Apologize to the photo. What? Apologize to the photo. Look at the photo. Don't just throw it there and disregard it. This is going to get you out of animal mode. We're not, that's not even baby mode. Now we're talking about animal mode, which is above baby mode. Yeah. I'm not in the mood. Okay, I am not in well, the well, Perry, mood. This is your job. So you're going to be in the mood to finish up your job. So look at the photo. Take a deep breath. Visualize what you want what in do? life. What do I do? I have no clue. And you're not here. So I don't know what to do. Why do you sound all weird all of a sudden? Because of what your speakers are like. What about your AirPods? Switch out your AirPod. Get the other one in. It might have ran out of battery. Well, I'm asking you too, Perry, because I'm just saying you sound weird. And I'm hearing myself bouncing back. It's Scarlett's husband. Keep my wife's name out of here. Disgusting, fat ass, greasy, cock-sucking, mouth. You better pray I don't run into you fat ass fuck. Lay a finger on me, punk. I'll let you kick my ass. Just to kick my ass. Just so I can put you behind bars, punk. Hi. New subscriber, glad to be here. Tell me the Baskin Robin story. Are you and Randy still together? Is Mole still your best friend? Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. 
I don't want anything to do with this R prick. And I have nothing to do with that M bastard. Meaning mold. We're done. All, all, the, all the evil sick shit from over 32 years ago. We're done. That's not mold. 32 fault. fucking years. That's not mold. Of fault. misery. He's a good guy. Who? It's not Mole's Well, if you weren't talking over me, I said that's not Mole's fault. It's he's a good guy. I'm not interested. I'm not interested. We're done. What about what about the uh, he said Baskin Robbins story, but I think he means Hagen does. Goodbye. It's stupid. Baskin and Robbins story it wasn't even outside of Baskin and Robbins. The only thing about Baskin and Robbins is my my uncle Paul used to well my mom and I used to make the the, uh, the tub cutters for Baskin and Robbins. Hey Perry, I'm so excited for the live show. My dream is to see my favorite celebrity of all time. Patrick, thank you. My favorite celebrity is you, my friend. Patrick Trulo. You're one of the best karate uh, champs I ever knew. Thank you. Yeah, it's too bad Big Joe's no longer with us, but otherwise uh, they'd all go work out together. This weather's really got me. After extensive research, I have discovered Perry is patient zero for the HIV virus. What the hell are you talking about? I don't have HIV. And why would you name me a number, whether it be zero, one, or whatever other number you want to name me? Not allowed. I don't have HIV. My mom is watching the stream tonight for the first time. Can you please retell the 92 story without swearing? Hell no! Hell no! How many years do I have to say the same stupid, obnoxious, uh, despicable, demented story? Hell fucking no! Now, yeah, I'll use the F word again and again and again because you people are driving me that nuts. If Perry was fake, Wendy said he would not exist. He's really like this PPL lol. How could I be fake? I'm right here in front of you. Stupid asses. Hey, loser. I signed us up for HelloFresh with your credit card. The chat can use code Perry92 for 20% their first to hear about your dick. What the hell is she talking about? <sighs> I have no idea what she's talking about. To clarify, murder threats are abuse whether from Perry's parents saying I'll murder you to Perry or from Perry saying I'll murder you to Tomb. That was just the language from the 60s, man. My God, uh, it was even said on TV shows. Oh, God. Get me off this. Hazy Cops, I live one hour away from your Pottstown gig, but I'm not sold yet because of your shitty treatment of Mr. Hawk. Can you cut a quick promo? No. I was good to the guy today. We sat right here. Send you a stupid promo. I don't know why he's got to go to uh, Pottstown when, when it's not even uh, his show. Uh, to I mean, be he fair, lives in enough. California. I mean, okay, it's nice that he does go all the way back east, but... Uh, to be fair, he's a bigger celebrity than you. That's probably why. The real Tony Hawk, not this guy.
Uh, thank you for subscribing. Hey buddy, Gina C is paid to hack into your account. I told her about Randy Gallagher, Callahan and Baskin, we still friends, baboon. What in the... F I don't know these people, is all I'm going to say. Gallagher, uh, the Gallagher, I saw him once on stage and that was it, but I, I don't know these people. Perry, it's my best friend's last day at work today. Can you please give an O-O-O? Oh, oh, oh! Perry, it has been a while but I'm really sorry for making you blow me. You were excited but it was not right of me to make you a star that way. I never blew you. You lying, evil, sick prick. I would never do that with anybody. Ever. Thank you for subscribing. Perry, checking in to give my respects to a fellow rocker. Got an interview in Australia this weekend and may give your stream a mention. Be in touch. Lou, brother man, thank you. Very nice. Thank you, thank you. Very nice to hear. Perry, thanks for honoring us with your stream. It's an honor to give you my cash and I thank you for taking it from me. Please don't scream at me. Who is this? Who sent that in? Because I couldn't understand the spelling of that word. <sighs> Got tickets to your upcoming show, little brother. Can't wait to see you there and discuss our lawsuits. You're not allowed to go back to uh, uh, the um, Pottstown, PA. <clears throat> You'll be blocked. You're not allowed in the doors. Uh, Perry, we still got to meet the mailbag quota to call this officially a mailbag stream, and you apparently didn't. What, 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 what is the mailbag fucking quota, huh? What is it? Another fucking hour? Huh? It ain't gonna fucking happen. I'll turn the goddamn computer off right well, the fuck now. I, Come was, here, actually, you son of a I was actually gonna say uh, just open one more mailbag, but if you want to act like an animal, you can do that too. Would you rather act like an animal? God. Get something big, Perry. A big box or something. That's not a big box. And I, I know you're, you're probably opening the stuff you picked up yesterday, but I prefer you pick from the sack that's been there for a while. And uh, apparently the conversation we had earlier made uh, no difference to you because you're still, you're still acting like an animal. And, and I'm just telling you, Perry, I don't want to do this anymore if you're going to be yelling at me like that. I really don't. So you make up your mind. If, if you want to continue earning a living from this, you, you let me know because I'm not earning anything. So you let me know if you want to keep screaming at me like that and you think that's justified. Uh, you go right ahead. You let me know, you let me know what's more valuable to you. After the stream. No, I don't. I'm talking now. I don't want to talk to you after the stream. I'm talking now. Because I've, I've had the, we had this conversation earlier, and it clearly didn't register because you're still screaming at it me and, talk, and talking to me like uh, like an animal. And I, I'm, I'm telling you right now, I'm not putting up with it. Before you open the box, Perry, I'm look at look at the screen. I'm not putting up with it. Do you understand? I'm not putting up with it either. So, so you're not the one who's going to end PCL. I will if you're the one going to be all talking. Right. About, okay. Well, all right. Well, you'll be living under a bridge within a couple of months. No, I'm not going to live under a bridge. Okay. Well, that's, that's... Or, or worse, or worse. So, Perry, before you open the box, before you open the box, can you at least acknowledge? That we're having a conversation here and I am not going to be talked to like that while I'm trying to earn you a living and pay your bills Thank you. and give you a savings so in years from now when PCL doesn't exist that you can have money to rely on, okay? Without that confused, dopey look, can you please acknowledge that this is a good thing for you? Well, 
All I'm asking yeah, for, yeah, yeah, taking my clothes. No, I'm not and, talking about destroying no, I'm not, my clothes. I'm not is a looking, good thing for me. That is not what I prefer. Okay, listen right? to me. Listen. So uh, you All might right. as well end this stream at the end of this stream because uh, okay. So I will. So Perry, I will. I will. Not what I like. Perry, I okay? will. Okay, you understand me. Perry, you're not in control here. I am. Okay, and put that knife down. Put the knife down. Stop opening the box. Okay, you understand me. I will end this right now, and I'm dead serious, because I, I am dead serious, okay? And then you're going to be begging me and all this, and that's going to be it, because once I walk away, I walk away. Don't shrug your shoulders or anything like that. Nobody's been carrying you more than me, not your useless family members, not any loser that you used to work for in the past who gave you no money and didn't care when you lost your disability or when you were on hard times, okay? I'm the one that's been carrying the bag, okay? Me. Nobody but me and I'm not going to be talked to like that. I'm not going to be screamed at I know it's inter entertaining for the stream, but I'm not going to be streamed I'm not going to be screamed at like that by the likes of you. Okay, I'll put up with a lot of things I'm not putting up with that and I'm just telling you right now. Okay, that's number one number two Don't talk to me about what happened on the stream today uh, with your sweater that you were paid two hundred dollars for uh, number one uh, so and, and act like that's not compartmentalized and part of something else okay so again check yourself i know you're logical like you'll be fine in a couple hours and you'll call me and tell me how sorry you are i'd rather you be logical right now while we're on the air uh doing this because i'm not well, i'm uh, not putting up i'm not putting up with your uh, you know you talk about your abuse i'm not putting up with the abuse that you give me okay so let's be clear about that okay and you're talking to me like how you just did is unnecessary. Stop with grabbing the mouse and turning everything down. I'm not putting up with it. It's just I'm not putting up with it. I got enough. I got enough problems in my life. I got a. I got another job. I, I got stuff that actually pays my. I don't need this. Okay. I don't need this. Okay. I do this for you. Okay. And hopefully, if it takes off and it gets really nice, then maybe we can all uh, benefit from it. But right now, this only benefits one person, and that's you. Okay. So you have a safe. So I know you have your mouth open and you want to talk. This is so you have a savings down the line. This is so you have money to pay your bills, okay? So you raging, saying you're gonna walk away from it all is moronic, the most moronic thing that you could possibly say, and that's really saying something, okay? So I'm not threatening you, I don't wanna do that, I don't wanna play these games or anything like that, I'm just telling you, put the knife down, put the knife down, put the knife down. Yes, yes. This is the part where you listen, okay? So have I adequately conveyed to you my concerns yeah. Okay, thank you. How about the apology now? I'm very sorry to mess with you. I'm not saying you're messing with me, Perry. It's not your fault. The, uh, it is messing with you. Okay, well, however we're going to... It's not your we're... fault. It's these others that are okay. pushing me. Compartment, compartmentalize, Perry. Don't transcend your anger towards other people, towards me. Okay, you and I are partners. You and I are coworkers. Correct. You and I are friends. Correct. I'm on your team. Okay, so don't treat Thank me you. like you treat everybody else. It's going to make it very difficult for me. I'm not trying to treat you like uh, uh, the one that's abusing me because it's not you that's abusing me. It's these others. Yeah, I get it. Okay. All right. Now you can open the box, please. Thank you. And when are we going to end today's stream? Very short. As we go an hour over time. And then we're plus over time. What is this? LED party light. No, there's no disco ball lights in my home. But that's what it note? says. Is there a note that came with that? Hold on. Dark Side Perry. We all know who that tip win is. Not me, that's for sure. Perry! The bubble machine, fog machine, and... What? The bubble machine, fog machine, and this party light is going to make Studio 102 the gayest pound party Hole in all of Reseda. The bubble machine. Didn't I give that away? Where's that damn thing? You gave it away a long time ago. Yeah, that's what I thought. I thought I gave the bubble machine away, and and, and uh, the bubbles are right there. 
Um, the fog machine is behind me, which is to be picked up the next time. Uh, <clears throat> what's his name's in town for their band? Um, in this, and then the party light. Well, the first two items are not in my home anymore. So, uh, then the fog light is not making this apartment a freaking discotheque. Okay. And no, a happy, a happy, happy pound party. The, the, the gayest pound party hole in, in all of Reseda. Yeah, right. I can already smell the uh, stale loads from, from Dark Side Perry. Well, there's nothing dark about me. I'm the truth teller. I've got no reason to lie or BS anybody. If you don't like it, that's your, that's your problem. Because I'll put everybody in their place right from the moment I meet them. Grab one, run more, and, and get a big one that's like in your way, and so you don't complain about having boxes in your house. Well, all right. Get a all big right. one. Like if you have a big package, open that. We, we've already gone an hour over. One hour, more than an hour. Over. This. Oh, that's pretty big. Yeah. Wow. We just open it, Perry, so everybody can see what what's oh. the deal. I hope this is something maybe for your uh, for the glass on the uh, sliding door. If that's like that's what I'm thinking. I'm I'm not sure. That would be awesome. The most thoughtful thing ever. See if there's a note in there, if that's possible. Let's turn the box upside down. Yeah, lots of little papers. Okay. Let's see what this says. This would be maybe my favorite mailbag ever if this is okay. actually like a window darkener. <laughs> that would have to go on like like wallpaper. Well, it's like plastic, like like aluminum foil right. like you do. Like that's except right, 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 a, a right. professional way of doing it. Maybe this will help to block out the uh, sun through your blinds when you uh, stream, Perry. Or Mark Lang. Well, thank you, brother. Thank you very much. By the way, Mark Lang, uh, get in touch with me because you're a hero. Uh, you're a hero. If this is the uh, window, um, it contains 42 by 72 light, light blocking window film. That's what it is. So it kind of just sticks on the glass, I think. Like, right. Exactly. Exactly. Right, so maybe we can do that over the weekend uh, and set that up. Uh, Oh, it's, it's a job to set this stuff no, up. No, I understand it is. I understand it is. Like it wall, is. It's like putting up wallpaper, okay? Right, but you know what? That's a great gift. Thank you very much. Yeah. Okay. All right, pull up a chair. Let's, that's it for the mailbag. And, and by the way, there's always people writing in, uh, you didn't get to my mailbag, blah, blah, blah. We will get to it eventually, if not this week. Eventually, not. It's not... Everybody's mailbag. I mean, I've got, I still have a bag. This time it's, it's uh, more like two thirds of a bag rather than a full bag, but uh, there's still a lot of bag there. Perry, thanks for honoring us with your stream. It's an honor to give you my cash and I thank you for taking it from me. Please don't scream at me. When you're that polite and that respectful, I'm honored and thank you. Thank you. No. This is Instagram. Confirming your password has been reset. 
If you are not located in Lancaster, California, please notify us immediately. Uh-oh. We have to shut down and you have to uh, fix this. Uh, uh, Instagram, the, the password is not to be reset. Contact Tom Brennan, Brennan Entertainment, please. Whoever uh, reached up my... my uh, yeah, I, I want to handle all Perry's Instagram uh, troubles. Please send all that to me. Yeah, it, contact Brennan Entertainment. The, whoever's in Lancaster, California, is not allowed to take over my Instagram page. Where not Lan allowed. Where is Lancaster? Lancaster, California. It's north of uh, where I'm at, off the 14 freeway. Hmm. Okay. Uh, all right, Perry, let's do this. Let's do your plugs. And we'll say goodbye like gentlemen. And I really hope the talks that you and I have had, even on this stream and then again off the stream when we talked yesterday, uh, resonate because, uh, again, you really have to work on your behavior towards me specifically. I, I don't want to, I, I can deal with baby mode. I don't want to deal with animal mode. Not that I can't deal with it, I just don't want to. Okay. I've yes, worked sir. hard enough in my life where I can decide what I what I do and don't want to do, and I don't want to do that. And I, are you still well, obsessed? Why are you really obsessed with those markers, even when we're having another important? Like every time, I know well, what then, I know. Then, then, then I throw them all away. Then now, how about you just leave away. them alone while you're streaming? How about you just leave them alone? You're obsessed with them. No, no, Forget no. It. Take Forget them out it. of the Try garbage. No, no. Take them out of the garbage. Take them out of the garbage and put them back where they were. You you just couldn't wait to touch those. There's you know there's something about you when we whenever we have a real conversation that you just can't uh, like you you have to find something. Things to bother me. Right, but you, too much shit. No, we're not talking about that right me. now. We're not. Don't raise your voice. We're too not, much shit. Harry, turn around. Me. Turn around. We're not talking about all that other stuff right now. Compartmentalize. We're having one conversation. You get distracted because you don't like hearing the truth. Uh, so pay attention. I just, I know this is the other trope he uses neck pain. So rather than totally ignoring me, like you've been doing all stream, all I want to say to you is I don't want to deal with animal mode. Perry telling me to go F myself and threatening to shut down the stream every two seconds. It well, takes too I much. Mean, I, don't... I, I know you don't mean whatever, Perry. I'm just saying, I don't want to deal with it live. Okay. As we're doing, especially on Monday nights where you get really worked up. I, I don't want to do, I, I don't personally want to deal with that anymore. I'm not saying you should sit here and talk like, talk about the weather and be all calm. You could be you and all that. And I can deal with baby mode to certain extents, but I'm not going to deal with being talked to like that. That's all. That's all. I, I, I respect you on, on that. No, don't think and I'm asking. The, I don't think I'm asking a lot. And, no, you're right. You're absolutely right. Okay. Let's do your plugs. So, please plug me. Wrong color, but uh, it's a little bit of a better what color. What color would you like, Perry? I'll make it any color. Leave it alone. Do not change the color. Leave it right there. I said wrong color because I can see. Visit our website for official PCL merch. Wrong way. Visit PCL merch. PerryCaravellaLive.com. There we go. Next day access to streams and bonus content. Uh, Patreon.com forward slash Perry Caravello. Subscribe on this way. Subscribe on YouTube. YouTube.com forward slash Perry Caravello Live. Order a cameo. Uh, there we go. Order a cameo. Cameo.com forward slash Perry Caravello. Join our Facebook groups. Group. First one. Facebook.com forward slash groups forward slash Perry Caravello. And then the next one, share your pets on Facebook.com forward slash groups forward slash PCL pets. Join the Discord this way. Join the Discord. Discord.gg. Come here. Discord.gg. There we go. Forward slash Perry Caravello live. There it is. Follow us on Twitter at P underscore C underscore L underscore official and at Perry underscore Caravello. Follow us on Instagram at Perry Caravello live. And you should find me on this page almost daily, if not daily at Perry Caravello on Instagram. Now follow us on TikTok. 
at Perry Caravello. If you want to send Perry mail, send the mail to Perry Caravello Live. 18960 Ventura Boulevard, Box 209, Tarzana, California, 91356. It is raining cats and dogs outside. So, um, before you get to the weather report, uh, I have one more Tom's tips to get to. This is the last one, and I want to get this from our friend Soviet Goat, who has said he's going to join us in uh, Pottstown, PA, on May 13th. It would be great to meet him. And he says, Francis, Twitter is going crazy with the news of your show in Pottstown, Pennsylvania. VIP tickets are being resold for thousands of dollars each. Hotels are offering PCL dudes-only pool party packages. Out of the fucking mind! There's no such thing as dudes only! And I want my women with me! Always! And the local McDonald's has guaranteed an increase in filet fish production and free deliveries to your hotel room. Then uh, I'm not going! I'm not fucking going! Kiss my fucking ass! Bob Levy is running a contest too. It's the official poll to find the biggest PCL fan. First person to get 92 votes gets a free VIP ticket and the opportunity to take a picture next to your butthole in Bob Levy's hot tub. Me and Carl Nelson are neck and neck with 91 votes each. Please, Perry, I want to see your steamy, gaped, cock-friendly anus. Log on to Twitter and vote for Soviet Goat. Do not want to meet you. Take it all back. I take it all back. You go, you you go to Pottstown, PA. I ain't going. This is why mom stopped loving you and loved you nothing. You always kept trying on ladies' clothes. I will post about it on your gram. Ha 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 ha. Uh, idiot. Idiot. Tramp. High desert whore. This was paid to be cut. This was a beautiful sweater. This was a beautiful winter sweater for years. So why'd you cut it? You you gave me two hundred bucks to cut it. I didn't give you two hundred bucks. Somebody else did. This is an automated message from Instagram. Your bank account has been linked with your device in Lancaster, California. Transfer of funds beginning. Again. End this now. Turn it off now. We're done. We're almost We're done. done. Harry. We're, We're, I, I got to get Harry. to the bank and, and fix this. Okay, just hold on. Hey, Perry. Are the rumors true that you are involved in Joe's death? Joe Ernesto? He was old. No, I was not involved in his death. He passed away. This is Instagram. Confirming your request to block Gina Carano, Margot Robbie, and Scarlett Johansson has been accepted. Wrong! Permanent wrong! Block. Wrong! Block. Wrong! Absolutely wrong! Do not block any of those girls in my life! Those are my famous girlfriends. Leave them alone. Do not block them in my on my. Um, do not block them in my life. Do not block them in my life. Block Amy Liberate in my life. That's who needs to be blocked in my life. This is Instagram. Confirming your profile has been updated to. Homosexual fake snowboarder. Removing my tattoo in Pottstown this May. Goodbye. Remove Done. tattoo. Done. None of that is true. None of that is ever going to be true. Get me off of I'm this. I'm reading through your emails and Instagram right now. Wow. You are sick. I am putting it all on the internet. Ha 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 sick, satanic, demonic, worshipping whore have liability access to my my account? 
How? 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 <laughs> Is this the part where you die on stream? I'm not dead yet, nor will I die. Simon Perry, you need to stop with using Sam's scream or you will get sued. I am looking out for you, buddy. It is $700 per scream. That you gotta get from Kenny. Not from me. You gave me the permission years ago to be able to use his scream. So the lies, again, are all a bunch of evil, evil demonic lies. Get, get, get me off of this because I got to get to the bank. All right. Got to get to the bank right like now. The, why do you have to get to the bank? Because my fucking whore sister-in-law is robbing me. Oh, God, you're hurting my ears. I have a headache. Uh, okay, listen, before we go, Perry, I just want to plug the... By the way, anytime Perry says he's not going to this live show, just ignore it. He's going. Uh, so Perry is going to be at... Where, Perry? Somewhere in, in PA. Potsdown, PA. Potsdown, that's it. P I've never been to Potsdown. Apparently it's about an hour uh, away from... Uh, uh, where you live? No, no. It's a good four hours from where I live, but it's about three hours from uh, Philly. Anyway... If you could stop playing. How's the hat holding up, Perry? Do I need to get you a new hat? Is well, it good? That looks it's right. a mess. All right. It's, it's you a mess. You're due for, how about this, Perry? You know what? Another thing I'll do for you. I've got okay. a bunch more. Okay. I know. I know uh, I got you a bunch, so we could swap it out. But let's let's just focus on this for right now. Uh, again, here's the, uh, here's the official uh, thing here. Soul Joe's presents in the ballroom of Soul Joe's somewhere in Pottstown, PA. It's the Uncle Rico show. You know the Uncle Rico show. Our friends, Bob Levy, Shuley, and Mike Morse. And they're doing a live show with live stand-up. By the way, Perry, are you going to have a little stand-up act ready? You want to do like five minutes of stand-up? You could. I, I really don't want to do five minutes of stand-up, but if I have to, I'll... You I'll don't have like... to, Perry, but I thought maybe writing a new five minutes of material, people would like it if you, you got up and did. Maybe you can do that between... You have two months to work on it. Yeah, we'll, we'll, oh, talk we'll, it we'll talk about it We'll talk about it. We'll talk about it. We'll talk about it private. Right now, he's just right going to appear. On right the... now, I'm going to appear at this uh, show. Right now, we're, we're here to finish this this yeah, today's yeah. show. Okay, listen. I got... Uh, I've got an emergency out there, and let's get this done. But this is, but Perry, this is important. This is important. Uh, oh, the emergency of my fucking bank account being robbed is not important. Go fuck yourself and get me off the goddamn street right the fuck now, you fuck. No, no, don't get that. Bye. Don't get that out of the we're air. Done. No, no, we're, we're not. Done. No, we're Bad not. Night. Perry, put that back. We're not done. I will sign off, and I will help oh, you. But I'm bitch. not gonna stop calling me names. That's not necessary. Okay, I, I'm right in the middle of promoting something that benefits you. As usual, so, by the way... Oh, and, and, and my bank account is... is yes, Perry, is, we'll fix that. We'll, we'll take care of that, Perry. Can you just compartmentalize and pay attention, Perry? And by the way, here's another thing that benefits you, Perry. Guess who's getting paid to be here? Guess who's getting paid to be at this event? We are getting paid. No, not paid. we. You. I'm not getting paid nothing. To go there, nothing, zero. Okay, I hope maybe I can get some money to, to cover my uh, gas money or something. I'm not getting paid. You are, Perry. So this behooves you to promote this, okay, and make sure our fans, our viewers of PCL, can get there. There's a limited amount of VIP tickets. You guys really want to go after the VIP if you're going to meet, want to meet Perry, do the meet and greet with everybody else. Obviously, Anthony Cumia, Casey Armstrong, uh, Mike Puschetti. Uh, I'll be honest, I don't know who these other two guys are, but Tony Hawk will be there, and the great Perry Caravello. Uh, there's an easier link if you want to get the uh, tickets. Just go to theshulynetwork.com. It'll redirect you. Type in theshulynetwork.com. It'll bring you right to the ticket page. If you guys can get tickets today, Friday, uh, March 10th, I think it'll show that PCL fans are showing up in force for this, okay? 
it, it, I, I'd like it to be a nice show of PCL fans. I know, Perry, this is boring to you, right? Promoting your show. Uh, yeah! And while my bank account is being robbed, you goddamn right it's boring to me! I gotta get to the bank now! Okay, so we'd like to see everybody there, right? Yes. Should I leave you one dollar and thirty four cents or take it all this time? Ha 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 ha